Hello, hello, hello. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the live stream. Before I start this time, I am definitely going to ask for a sound check to make sure that you guys can hear me and make sure the music's not too loud as well. Let's definitely double check that first whilst I tweet this out as well. Are we live? I think so. Oh, there we go. We are. The delay on YouTube is always confusing. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Music's okay, you can hear me. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So that's, uh, there we go. We can get straight into this and start. We're playing some amazing Traveler's Rest. The cozy, very addicting game, like a tavern simulator. And uh, yeah, we're gonna con a few videos and streams on this already. Um, and I want to continue it. It's very relaxing. I've got a lot to do still. It's been updated, so there's a lot of new content. And yeah, this is this should be fun. This should be good. I'm doing good, Crab. I'm doing very well, thank you for asking. Doing well this weekend. Hope you are doing well too. I am doing very good, uh, Tootsie. Hopefully you guys are doing good as well. Let's get started. Uh, so here we go in Sharky's Lair. That's the name of the tavern. I want to explore this update a little bit more because there is a few more things that we can do. Let's make the bed. I'll turn this volume down in my ears. There we go. Right, let's pet this damn cat. Oh, the heart's gone down. Literally, if you forget like once, it goes down so fast. I want to still get that full heart. So what we've made here is we've made some roasted fish, some barley, some flour. Rose wine and some mead. Nice. I think we need to do that for a quest actually. I'll go and check the board before I get uh, some more things produced. So, in the last like video that I did, we expanded the tavern. We've got a little bit of room now, which is good because we can get some more tables and chairs, which means more customers. So, that should be really good. Definitely want to craft some of those today, and we'll do a little bit of organizing and decorating the tavern. Apparently, if we move these tables horizontal, is it? The, basically, the opposite way. Like this, you can actually get more in. So, this is what we sh probably should be doing. Yeah, because you can go right to the, um, to the wall there. Let me try this. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, a little bit of space in the corner there. But if we go a bit more central, maybe put the candle in the corner there, and let's do another big table. Yeah, just like that. Okay, that's good. That's not bad. That's not bad. And then we could get more tape. Should we go the same, the same length like this? Don't want to get in the way of the stairs there, so maybe we'll come centre. Yeah. Oh, and I need to get to the fire as well. I feel like we're not going to get as much in there if we do it like this. I feel like it's better if we do it this way. Surely. I don't want to get in the way of the fire there, so maybe this one needs to be... Let me have a look. I want to get as much seats as we can in here. Um, not sure what we could do. Hello, hello, Amy. Hello, Shania. Hello, Taylor. Hello, Tibby. Lily, how are you guys doing? How's the recovery work for the Crook File treating you so far? If you're talking about the survival series, I'm basically up and running. It's going to be incredible. I'm super excited. It's going to be good, guys. It's going to be good. Can we put that one there like that? Um. Hmm. I don't know what better way we could do this. Get the little table here like that. Can 
Can that go like that? I don't think it can. We'll have to go... You have two people sat on one of those tables? Let's do something like that. Right, um, maybe we need to expand down a little bit more. I don't know what... So we've got a lot of space in the center here. I feel like we should maybe go cross with this a little bit more. Because that's just going to waste space. And then maybe if we go uh, lengthways like that... On this one. Can we still get through there? Yeah, we can. Okay. That's giving us a bit more space now. And then if we go like that. Yeah, then we get another one of these tables. Maybe lengthways on the bottom. Right, okay. That's. I think that's not bad. Let's go ahead and do some crafting. I'm, see if I can make any more of those tables and chairs. Um, I could buy them, but I think... Yeah, money's low from the last video. I do already have a large table that we ordered, and we've got some seeds as well. I do need to plant some of those, because I've got no crops. What have we got? Iron nails, we've got some iron bars. Yeah, let's do some... Right, we've got some juniper. And strobs. I've got some candles, I do need to buy more though. Right, let's get some of these planted. Might get rid of this grass and use it to build stuff. I don't know. This is all my space up here. Let's plant up here first. I feel like I've got too much space for plants that I don't really use. And it's just a waste of space. Let's get these strobs. Lots of berries. Can you not walk through there? A little bit. Looking good. Now, I love this game because you don't have to water. You can just... Ooh. These are bushes. Okay. That makes sense. Let's put these here. Have we got any more? We've got some cabbage and garlic. run everywhere and plant them as much as we can and we've got 20 garlic as well okay maybe do the rest here somewhere like this yeah that'll do we've got some pear trees here that are oh there we go we can harvest the last lot of those and then we can get some more fruit trees above there don't know which ones to go for though you love this game Lily yeah me too it's amazing Glad to caught your stream. Time to relax. Yes. Get cozy, guys. Stardew Valley, is that you? <laughs> Come on. Don't be mean. This game's not that much of a clone. Hello, bonsai lady. Welcome to the stream. Okay. So, yeah. Let me see what we can craft here. I want tables and chairs, but I feel like we need more wood. Stool. It's over here, right? On the work. Yeah. Ooh. These are trending. So people like these tables. They prefer the individual and the small ones compared to the big ones. Interesting. So we need some wooden planks, guys. We need some wooden planks. Uh, I've got 49 here, but this was used to expand. I was using... You know what? Maybe we should take those for now. We should need planks to expand the tavern as well. So I couldn't... I don't really want to make small ones, though. I know they're trending, but we need big ones. Can hold more people then. Hmm. Might just get one of those for now. What about a stool? We need more planks. We need 30. Right, let me go and have a look because we've also got an. Where's the other one? Didn't we get another one? Or did I put that down already? You've been dying to try this game. How do we like it? This game is awesome. It's very cozy, very relaxing, and it can get quite addicting as well. You know, you run your own tavern. You're serving customers. You're making lots of wine and beer and produce. Yeah, you can farm, explore. It's really good, and it's early access, so there's still a lot that this game can bring, you know? 
Oh no, of course, this we are crafting one. This is the one that we got from... Oh, this yeah, these are huge. Wow. It's so hard to decide how to... Put these. And then maybe another large one down here. Then we need another one of these. So, what I might do, let's see what we can do with this. Can we get... Oh, we can't. Oh, we can get that right down the bottom. Nice. I didn't think we could do that. So then we can have... Yeah, a large table down here. Two large, two medium, two large, two medium, and then these are little individuals. I think that might work. So we are crafting, so we just need some stools. So what I'm going to do is get the axe, and we're going to chop down some trees, get lots of wood. Oh yeah, we made some polished stone there. Nice, let's put all that away. And all the iron as well. Got to do some organizing, you know. Make those storage chests organized. There we go. And we'll get some more wood. That's definitely what we need. Luckily, I've got a lot of trees that's been growing. I've planted a lot of saplings. It's quite hard to get wood in this game. It does take time. But we should be okay today because look at all the trees that we've got. Someone said in the comments that trees don't grow when you've got grass around. But I don't think that's true because I never really get rid of the grass. And they still grow, as you can see. So I don't actually know if that's true. The grass always grows on this game, so I can't imagine that being accurate. You're listening to you, uh, listening to you chill since I am playing last. I don't understand what you mean, crab, but I'm, I'm guessing you're having a cozy, relaxing time watching me while you're playing as well, maybe? Hello, Rena. Welcome. How are you doing? Hairy beast. Hey, Sharky. I see that you play my favorite game. Yes, absolutely. My favorite game, too, at the moment. Really, really good. It's so cute looking. Yeah, it does look cute, don't it? I do like the visuals of this game. It's got a very gorgeous pixel art. If you haven't played this game already, make sure you check it out. I think it's definitely worth it. Of course, it's early access, but they are updating it frequently. We've had quite a few updates recently. Um... Which is good, you know, they are updating the game. They're not just leaving it. It's got a lot of uh, possibilities, this game. You could do so much with it. Let's get, well, we're getting a lot of wood now. This is amazing. That was a big tree, that one. So we've got 18 pieces there. Oh, it does take such a long time to get wood. Now, some of these trees can grow a bit more. So, like this one here, these ones, they, you know, they do have, like, growth sizes. And the bigger they get, the more wood they'll give you. So, I'm going to let these smallish ones grow a little bit more because they will give, give us more wood in return. So, like those ones, you can just clearly tell a little bit which ones are bigger. Do you use a desktop or laptop for gaming? I do use a desktop computer. A gaming PC. I mean, I do make videos, so it's kind of handy and very important when you're rendering videos all the time. It does take a big, heavy impact on your computer, so I can't imagine a laptop handling it, unless it's a really good one. But when I first started doing YouTube, I did in fact have a laptop. And then I just used some of the, uh, you know, the ad revenue, the money, my first payday, upgraded equipment, that's how it goes, you know. You've got to spend money to make money. But yeah, I started off with the, the lowest equipment possible. A cheap mic. <laughs> a cheap laptop. Watching your videos when I relax is very comfy, Sharky. Very chill. I'm glad you think so, Lily. We do love the cosy vibes on this channel. All the cosy games. That'll be... Uh we're getting a lot of wood now. These are still small. This one's quite big still, so we'll take you down. I've got a cup of tea. Has everybody got a beverage? What are you drinking right now? Let me know what you've got. I've got a nice brew. 
Hi Sharky, I love Traveller's Rest. I've had a lot of fun with this game so far. From what I've gathered, the crown icon is things you've marked as favourites. Oh really? I thought it was trending. Oh yeah, I did actually see someone comment about that. But I don't know how or what I've done. I don't know why I've marked them as favourite. Let me have a look. How do we... How do you mark them? Is the special key that you need to press that I've accidentally pressed maybe? I don't know why they are favourites. I don't know what I've pressed. Is there a key for that? Water, Yumi tea, Vimto and what? Hey, Vimto's lovely. I love that. Vimto's good stuff. Is that just a like a an English thing? Or is Vimto like... I don't even know. Is Vimto British? I don't even know. Sweet tea and cheese sandwich. Lovely. We could open the tavern. We need to make some money. I think I might do that. He's drinking G fuel? Uh, G fuel? Oh my god. Do you remember when that thing was like... So popular? I feel like it's died down a little bit now, G fuel. Unless people still drink it, but... I definitely had some when it first became a big thing. But then, uh... Yeah, I kind of... Weaned off of that stuff. Vimto's a British thing. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. So, it is 7pm. We could open for a few hours. Uh, we have got... Uh, the only thing is we haven't got no stools. So, some of these tables have got nothing... <laughs> nothing for people to sit at. Hmm. But we could still open and make a little bit of money, I guess. Um... We just need to get one, two, three, four benches, okay? That's the next step. And then maybe I can get some more tables here. We've got quite a lot of space, really. What I'll do is I'll move this table over here, just so it's not so far away. And we'll do the same as well. Um, with this one. There we go. Oh, we need another bench down here, right? Oh no, there's one hiding there. So I'm wondering how many we could get here. Could we squeeze three in there? I don't know. Right, let's open. Oh, we ain't got much time. But I've opened it anyway. Um, oh yeah, we've got to put the fire on. There we go. We've got a magic room, so we don't have to do any cleaning. The cat wants to come out. Right, I'll pet you as well. Where are you going? Get here. God, the heart goes down so fast. Oh, someone wants to go into a room that we've got. So, neutral. Uh, oh, these are very... Oh, is the room... I didn't clean the room. No, we've got to, we've got to um, get rid of that. I'll quickly go and have a look at the room. I think it needs cleaning. Yeah, it does. From the last person. Oh, no. Let's hurry up quick. Uh, can, we, can we clean? Oh, we're going to... Customers are going to get angry. But we do want to get someone in here, really. Right, I think it's okay. We should be able to get someone in now. I think that's it. Okay, let's go, 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 go. Hopefully no one's left and getting angry. Okay, I'm coming, I'm here. Sorry, I've got to do everything. I should have probably hired some staff to clean that room. But it's all good, it's all good. So someone might ask us now to join the room. Hopefully, it is cleaned. It was filthy. We'll see. Right, I do have to clean tables myself because the magic broom only does the floor. So let's put the cleaning vision on so I can see what needs to be cleaned. Oh, we need candles too. Let's put one in there. One in... Oh, we've not got a candle holder there. Like, they've still got... S I'll probably just be out one for now. Yeah, we're, we're doing good. Where's the customers? There we go. I mean, it's quite late. Let's make some money. We've already got two gold. Turn that off. I can see the tables. Right, the magic broom's going. Look at that. Best thing in the game. 
Hands down. What a great item. No one's kicking off. Let's get the brush on and the mop on just in case. Serving all this stuff. All the beer, they've got champagne, the magic. What's that thing called? Is it like... I forgot what it's called. Ghostly breath. Yeah, that stuff's good. So, we've stocked up quite well. We do need some more beer soon, though. And some wine. The wine's running low as well. Tomorrow, we'll have a good day of producing stuff. Stock up on the tavern. Right, we do have a table that needs cleaning. Two of them, actually. Three. Oh, yeah, they're all getting dirty now. Take your eyes off it for one second. I'm coming. Here we go. Have all your beers. Oh, rented room. There we go. It's clean. We'll accept. Thank you very much. Enjoy your stay in the Sharky's Lair. <laughs> I'll clean your table, love. I won't forget about you. Don't worry. Oh, yeah. We're making some dosh. Look at it go up. Good day, sir. The magic broom? Uh, oh, I actually don't know. I think we just got given it for some quest that we did. I can't really remember if I'm honest. Um, but def I got it quite a long time ago. Quite early on in the game. This game looks great. Hopefully it comes to Switch. Yeah, that would be good. This game definitely feels like a a good switch game. Very cozy, relaxing. It's not on Switch yet, but I think it is game plan to release on Switch. I've got another table here. I might close at 1 a.m. That's quite late. Last order's coming up soon, I think. Gain some good reputation here as well, though. When we get more benches for those two, we can have a lot of people come in. More customers, more money, right? More reputation as well. Right, okay, after this customer here, or these two, we're going to have to do last orders. There we go. I've got some cleaning to do. And then this one, and I think we should be okay. Let's get all that reputation. There they all go. They're leaving. Good night. Thank you for staying. Oh, yeah. Look at all that. Nice. So we managed to get four gold. You know, we had we didn't even have one. So not bad for a couple of hours there. We opened quite late, to be honest. And we do definitely need to get more people in here. So let's put out the fire for now. Otherwise, we'll just waste the coal. And let's just... Oh, we're going to have to sleep, to be honest. I'm going to have a little look. We need to put some planks on the go. There we go. Let's get all of that on. So we get eight planks now per wood that we use because we do have these things here. The wooden storage things. Or the log plank storage. We could do with making another one of those. Yeah, plank stockpile. So when you get one of these down, you get one extra bonus plank every time you craft. Oh, we're getting tired. Okay. It plays well, awesome on Steam Deck. Oh, that sounds cool. I really want a Steam Deck. I've heard good things about them. Yeah, we're sleeping. Don't worry. You wouldn't mind if they made it online co-op as well. Yeah, I don't know how that would work, but I think it would be interesting. Hmm. Customers in your rented rooms will leave at some point in the day. Yeah, we can actually go and kick them out if we really want the room early. Or they'll just leave at some time on their own. And then we go and clean it before we open the tavern. I should always remember that. Right, we didn't actually put any beer or wine on. So what I'm going to do... Where's the cat for a start? Oh yeah, look at the heart. We're getting there. We're getting there. 
Let's go and take a look at the quests and see what we need to be making. This gives us some good XP. Orders. So we are working on, at the moment, IPA with honey, roasted beef with veg, and roasted fish with cabbage. Right, remember that. Oh, I've planted the cabbage. We've not gotten on yet. So we can do the roast beef with any veg, and the IPA with the honey. Okay, that sounds good to me. Let's have a look. Roast beef first. We need brandy? How did we get that? I didn't know you needed that. Oh, no. Oh, no, roast the beef. That's roast beef or roasted beef. Which one did it say we needed? I don't think it's roast beef, right? I think it's this one. With any veg. So can we just put a carrot in there? Let's try that. Right, what do we need? We've got loads of raisins. Uh, let's do some malted wheat. I don't know how I've favorited these. There must be a key that you press to remove them. I remember someone saying in the in the comments, because I thought this meant it was trending, but it's not. I've just favorited it. So they'll always be at the, the front, if that makes sense. Um, let's do some red grape musk. We need to, need to make some more red wine. And actually, I'm going to do that right now. So we'll make some red wine juice. Oh, no, we need the IPA with honey, right? And we've got some, yes. There we go, IPA honey. That's going to be for the orders. Sounds good to me. Let's put away some of this stuff. Um, we actually have some saplings from knocking down the trees, which is really good. I feel like they've increased that a little bit. It used to be hard to get them. Right, let's organize a little bit. We've actually got some roasted fish here. Not with cabbage, though. We do need the one with cabbage. Wait for them to grow. Let's put away these fish in the order menu. Um, yeah, drinks are looking very low, aren't they? We have all this mead here that we could open up or pour into bottles. But the only problem is, I think you need mead to create this, the ghostly breath. And look how much this sells for. If I'm right, that's what we do. I need another one of these brewing barrels so we can make more more than one at a time. I might look into that as well. There's so much to do. Cat, every time I see you, I'm going to pet you. There's achievement that you can get for getting a full heart. And I'm trying my best to get it. Thanks, Sharky, for the relaxed stream. Uh, I sit on the couch with my daughter and watch the stream. That sounds awesome, um, Burger. I'm glad you're having a cozy, relaxing time. Okay, we've got some wooden planks. Let's go. We can actually make some benches now, I'm sure. No, we can't. We need nails. Uh, where are those? Got plenty in there, though. Plenty in there, and I think we have more in this chest. What I will do is make some more. Nails are so important in this game. I use all this forestry waste on this fuel. And we've got more nails in here. 15. Okay. We're doing well. Look how much wood we've got. 51. Alright. Okay, so... Now let's have a look if we can make some benches. We need the large ones. One. Oh, God, look. Oh, do we need fuel? No? What's going on? What do we need? More planks. Of course we do. It's always planks. Get more of those on the go. I probably should have done the plank stockpile. Can I cancel these? Yeah, we can. I'm going to make another stockpile when these ones are done. And we should be able to put that right here. And then we can make nine planks from... Is it four wood? How much wood does the planks use? No, it's two wood. Two wood for nine planks it's going to be. Let's get that on the go. That's going to be amazing. Let's see if we can chop any more trees down, actually. Crops are looking good. Yes, yes, yes. But I feel like this one's grown now. It's quite big. If you hire the housekeeper, she only turns up when there's stuff for her to do. And then she'll leave. Don't pay her for hours where there's nothing for her to do. 
Yeah, I can, I've only got one room at the moment. So it's very easy for me to go up and clean. So before I open the tavern, I'll just make sure I clean and tidy the room. That way, if somebody else wants to go in, it's not going to be filthy, is it? But when you have multiple rooms, if you've got three, four, maybe even five rooms, definitely having a housekeeper to go in there and clean every time is going to be so much quicker and better for me. At the moment, I can handle it, though. Just need to expand that tavern. It's so grindy, though, but I do love it. I love a grindy game. You need so much materials in order to expand, you know. And I like it because you can expand multiple things. So you can have the actual tavern downstairs to be bigger so you can get more customers for food and drink. And then you can expand upstairs for the rooms where people can stay for the night. So there's like two things you can work on. It's so hard to <laughs> like decide what you want to spend your resources on. But wood, nails, uh, mortar and stone, you need it all. And of course, gold. So expensive. Right, these trees are still small. I'm going to leave them. Now, we do have some saplings. We've got five chestnuts. 13 oak. Let's go. Now we can plant these again, guys. And um, get even more wood back. These are very expensive to buy. If you want to buy saplings, they are not cheap. Well, you can actually just place them anywhere you want. You don't have to stand where they need to be. Very handy. Look at all the wood that we're going to have. Oh, my God. Yes, I can't wait for them to grow. Now, like I said, some people do say that they won't grow if the grass is there. But I've never done this, and they always still manage to grow. But I'll do it anyway, just in case. Right, we're going to need the iron and the coal. We're going to go up and get everything we can. We'll check out the new areas as well for the update because there is a new place which I still need to do the quest for. If you haven't already, guys, make sure you hit that like button. It really does help out the stream and helps out the channel more than you believe. Thank you to everyone who already has, though. I appreciate you all. And thank you for popping into the stream today as well. On this cozy Saturday. Is it Saturday? Yeah, it's Saturday. <laughs> I'm losing track of days. I've been working hard at the moment on uh, a few video ideas that I've got. I've got at least five videos that's coming out, and they're all quite big and taking a lot of time to, to work on and edit. So, yeah, it's been a bit slow uploading the videos, but I'm trying to work on these, like, four or five that I want to get out. And I can't wait to release them. You know, the joys of editing on yourself. I don't have any editors. I do it all on my own. Everything that you see on this channel is 100% me. <laughs> but I love it that way. I don't think I'll ever pay an editor to do it for me. I'm so set in my own ways, you know. Unless there's like a clone version of me. <laughs> I actually get a lot of emails. Near enough every day of people asking if they can be my editor. But I just don't think I can do that yet. I like my own style. And my own routine. Maybe one day. This game has progressed so much since I last popped in. Exactly, Steve. This game is getting updated a lot and I love it. I can't wait for full release. I don't know how long it's going to be. I can remember speaking to one of the uh, the guys who was working on it. And I did ask, like, you know, is the potential release soon? And they did say it's going to be a couple of years. One or two years. That, that's what they're aiming for. That's not guaranteed. So it's definitely not going to be full release this year. And, you know, maybe a 50% chance for next. We could maybe see this in 2025, which I know is quite far away. But I would rather the game be absolutely amazing, full of content, and to a good place, rather than we're getting it next year or this year, and there's hardly nothing to the game, you know? Right, okay. There's the planks. Can we make another... Right, hold on. First of all, let's get this stockpile. So this is going to give us an extra an extra plank every time we craft. Yes, please. So let's see. We should get nine now. Let's have a look. Yeah, look at that. Nine planks from two pieces of wood. That's so good. 
It used to be six. We've gained an extra three just by having these here. And planks are so important in this game. It's absolutely wild. Maybe I could do another one as well, but can we squeeze it maybe up here? Yeah, that, that might be quite good if we could have ten. Let's cancel that and go for another plank stockpile. Ten for every two pieces of wood. That sounds incredible. We need that big time. And then we'll be able to progress a little bit quicker. Now, let's get this stone because we also not only need to work on planks and nails, we need to work on stone blocks and mortar, which is another hard thing to get in this game. It's 11.30 a.m. for me here in Kansas. Oh, nice. Nice early morning. For me, it is... Well, it's... Yeah, it's 5.30 p.m. just gone. So we are in the evening. So we need stone blocks. Definitely. And then we also need... Those stone blocks with water and those polished bricks to make mortar. Oh, it's just never-ending. Uh, so let's go with the stone blocks first. and shreds, mortar and pestle. Have we got any of those? We should maybe craft that. I don't know what it gives us, but we do need that, I think. I'm going to make one. Actually, oh, there's the actual fermentation tank that we need. But look at that, 40 stone block. Oh my god. We can buy one of these for four gold. That's too much money, though. That's literally all the resources we need to expand the tavern. Nails, stone blocks, and mortar. Oh my god. That is wild. Oh, damn. Let's go... I'm not going to open the tavern today because we need to... We ain't, we're we running low on supplies, to be honest. And I want to craft those benches to be able to let people come and sit down. Let's see if the IPA is done. Yeah, it is. Let's get all the good stuff. There we go. So that's why we need the mead. This ghostly breath. Oh my god, it sells for a lot of money. So I'm going to make some more of that right away. Grape juice. Uh... Let's go with some more red wine. Stock up on this stuff big time. Food wise, what shall we make guys? Let me know here in the chat. What do you want me to cook up? And then I'll take some suggestions for ingredients as well. What do you reckon? We can have stew, we can have some pie, sweet or savoury. We can have some porridge, beef, pork, sausages, bread. What do you want to see? Cat, yeah, I do need to do that. Um, the cat. And he wants water, otherwise he's going to cry. Damn cat, you're so needy. Ugh, can we... Okay, it's still okay. Halfway there for the heart. Pie, okay, pie. So we're definitely having pie. Right, sweet or savoury is the next question. Which one, guys? A sweet pie or a savoury pie? Savoury pie is a great money maker. Alright, okay. Now, ingredients. So we need veg and meat. So what kind of meat shall we put in here? Shall we have beef, pork, or turkey? Let me know, guys. Whatever I see first. Turkey. That was the first one I saw. Right now, two vegetables. The first two vegetables that I see. What have we got? Carrot is one vegetable. <laughs> A lot of people are saying carrot. One more vegetable. A leek. There we go. So there we go, we've made a turkey, carrot, and leek savoury pie. Hey, you know what? It sounds good. Would you guys eat that? I think I, I would, to be honest. <laughs> well, unless you're vegetarian, and then you're not going to do that, are you? A lot of carrot fans. Yeah, I just saw loads of carrots. <laughs> carrots are lovely. Right, we're not going to open. That's all producing. We've got the IPA honey, so let's complete this order form. There we go. And we'll send that off. Nice. I've actually got some of this roast beef with... Oh, how much do we need? Ten. Damn. They wanted it all. 
Right, we can actually accept. Oh my god, look at this. We can actually accept an order for save reply. And we're actually about to do that right now. And then we can do. Let's do the lager with some honey. I'll actually make that next after the ghostly breath. So look at this, guys. These things are trending right now. So these are the beers that people are wanting. We need to be working on this. Mild Ale, some Pilsner, never heard of that, and Porter. And the bread. So, you know, customers are going to want these the most. So if you've got these stocked up on your menu, they'll come for these a lot, you know, and it's a good way of making a big amount of money. So if you just, you know, put loads of uh, bread in there or wheat bread, it's going to sell fast. And wheat bread and rye bread is very easy to make, actually. So, and this changes it every two days, I think. It's good to know. Let me have a look. Have we got any skills that we need to do? We have got five green points and two blue. Amber. Okay. So we can make the porter. And the mild ale. Can't do any of that yet. We only need cheese. Cheese is the last one, but we need to be level 11. We've done all of the food so far. We've got all of the crops that we can get, all the crafting. Can't wait to see these two guys. Magic is coming to the game and social. How great is that going to be? So I'm guessing with the social, it's going to help with like bartering or I don't know, trying to sell and buy things. Right. We've got another stockpile. Let's get this baby down. Uh. Hmm. So we're going to have to rotate you. You can go like that. Oh, can't we not go up? Oh, I thought we could maybe go sideways. I'll go right there. That's fine. Oh, you can actually squeeze through. I love that, by the way. You never get blocked in the game, basically. Right, so look, if we make... Actually, I'm going to make... We need another bench, right? Yep. And then the planks. We're getting ten. Ten! Oh, we're making so much planks now. I love it. We've got one bench. One's on the way. Empty kegs. I need to fill up the water as well. It's looking good. Should we go to the new area? See if we can speak to that guy. At the water. We've got some trees down here as well, but not many because I've not been planting them down here. Snow is nice until it gets slushy. We've had a lot of snow here, by the way. Here in England or the UK, we've had about three or four inches of snow where I live um, for the last two days. It's the first snow we've had this season. And we're in March. That is so crazy. But yeah, it's been snowing quite a lot. Um, it's starting to clear up now, but they've just gave out on the forecast more heavy snow in the area, so <laughs> It's uh, came disappeared and it's gonna come back again. It seems But I do love the snow right, Let's go to the new place I'd like to see 100 gold challenge. Hey, you know what? I'm down for that. Trying to get to 100 gold. That might be a series. We could do that. This is the new area that's been unlocked for this update. It's huge. It's like a big farm area. And this is that guy. He did say he's going to come and visit us once he's finished unpacking. But he seems like he's taking forever. I don't know what we've got to do. Hey, oh, he's here. My daughter Viola has been grumpy the whole way. Leaving her whole life in the city has not been easy for her. I don't know what we can do with that. We can't even go inside. I just kind of got to wait for him. But my favourite person in this game, the favourite character, is this stone golem here with the chicken. Nugget! <laughs> Bob and Nugget. I love these. These are so cool. Right, let's see what's in the shop today. Oh my god, we can buy some of these tree saplings, and they're quite cheap. I'm sure they're cheaper than normal. Uh, eggs as well, of course. Nugget's eggs. Um, I could buy, I mean, eight silver. 
Yeah, I mean, you can only buy what's in stock, so we'll buy all of those. Why not? They'll give us some good wood. I think his stock changes every couple of days. Because he does sometimes sell wood and stone, and it seems like he sells tree saplings now, which is good. The stone dude and nugget, yeah, they're my favourite. I love them. I wish, that, well, I hope that they keep adding new NPCs, because obviously... That's one thing in this game that there's not very many of. NPCs like this that you can interact and talk to and stuff like that. So this update was great because we've got this character here and his family, which we've not met yet. And then, of course, the stone golem, Bob and Nugget. We had some uh, NPCs above the tavern. But you can't really do much with them. I don't really know what they're there for. I'll go and show you. And then for the Halloween update, we had the ghost, which was quite good, and the spirits. And then we had the winter update. We had the snowman. Uh, he was, was he called Frosty? He was cool. Thank you guys so much for se over, just over 70 likes. I appreciate you all. And Peggy. Peggy, thank you so much for the, uh, the super chat. Good afternoon from Atlanta. Uh, always enjoy your lives, Sharky. Wearing your shirt today. Oh, I love that, Peggy. Thank you so much for your support. You've been supporting for so long. I don't know how you still do it. I've seen you around for years, and I really do appreciate you so much. Turkey! Give me a meat! Ah. Yes. So these are the people that was originally in the game. But I don't really know what these do. Do these actually have a storyline, guys, or not? Does anyone know who's played this game? Or are they kind of just like... There. And of course we have the guy who's frozen as well in the mine. This game looks a bit like Graveyard Keeper. Yeah, it really does uh, remind me of Graveyard Keeper. Which I think is one of the reasons why I think I love this game a lot. Because Graveyard Keeper literally is in my top five. I, I love that game so much. And Traveler's Rest really does remind me of Stardew Valley mixed with Graveyard Keeper. Two of my favourite games. Like, it's so good. You've got the medieval dark vibes with, you know, owning a tavern and, and all that kind of stuff. Making beer and things. But then you've also got the cosy, relaxing farming life, you know. It's a bit of both. Yeah, this is the guy who's frozen. Because you are good and fun to watch. I appreciate that, Peggy. <laughs> Thank you so much. You are a star. gonna get all the resources up here uh, iron's gonna be a big thing we need all those nails and I'm hoping if we open the tavern tomorrow we can get a good decent amount of gold and we'll maybe do an expansion again or create a new room for people to come by so we can have two guests at a time rather than just one so I think that's what we can work towards on the stream today trying to create a new guest room you guys can help me choose uh, how you want it to look what decorations we can get so stay tuned for that. It's literally going to be from you guys. You're going to create this guest room. You can put whatever you want in there. It's so cool. There's so much decoration. Hopefully they bring more as well. Like these rugs and tables and stuff like that. You bought St. Avon this morning. Seems amazing. Have you played it? I have played it, but it was a long time ago, Melanie. And like I said, every time I do... I am meaning to get back into that game. So maybe I'll do a stream or a video where we check that out. Because it's been such a long time. You're going to get this game tomorrow, so you should enjoy it. You love Grave Graveyard Keeper as well, so I suppose you should get this. Yeah, you should. If you do like Graveyard Keeper, then yeah, definitely try this game out yourself. I mean, it's not highly similar to Graveyard Keeper, but the similarities are there. You know, Graveyard Keeper is a very unique, special game. 
So it's 10 p.m. We should go back. We've gathered a few more materials here. Uh, not much stone though. Wow. Why did we not? Why have we only got two pieces of stone? Oh, there's a block here that we need to get. Stone is what we need the most. There we go. The cat. <laughs> Thank you, Noodles. You keep reminding me. Cat. I will get a full heart. Yeah, we'll go back and we'll sort the cat out. <laughs> I appreciate you reminding me. Because I do forget a lot. Now, this is the stone block that I always get. I forgot. You're actually starting to get sleepy finally. There was a lot of activity in my apartment complex and people was being loud. I did want to sleep last night, but nope. Insomnia and being... Uh, uh, now it doesn't work well. Yeah. Well, hopefully you can get some good sleep tonight, uh, Lily. I do hope you get some good sleep. And hopefully your neighbours aren't too loud. Tell them to be quiet. If I was there, I'd be knocking on the door. Shut up! I'm trying to sleep! <laughs> I'm quite lucky where I live because... I live in a quite a very quiet village. Uh, and on my street, there's a lot of, like, old people who live here. So it's very, very quiet, to be honest. Which, you know, can't complain. I can't think of anything worse than living next to, like, some young teenagers or whatever who's just blazing music all the time. Right, there's the last two benches, guys. I think we should be good. We've got two for one table. Two's on the way. Yes, come on. Let's get some more of these planks. I love that we're getting ten each time. It's really helping us a lot. Right, we're going to make some more iron bars. We've got a lot of iron ore. I'll fuel this a little bit more. And then I'll make some more nails. Oh, we can make some metal jugs. Look at this decorative sword. I really like the looks of that. And I do actually need a candle holder as well. I'm actually going to make two of those. We've got two new tables. No, one table needs one. I'll get three. Oh, look at this as well. The ornamental armor. Oh, it's using 40 nails, though, and we really need those. I can't do that just yet. That sucks. I do hate that you have to fuel the anvil. doesn't make sense to me. I don't think they'll change it, but I hope they did. <laughs> Why do you need to fuel an anvil? Oh, we've got the, uh, the mortar and pestle. Let's see what this does. I'm actually curious. Oh, it's just decoration. Damn it. I thought this prop, like, might have been able to create something. <laughs> That's annoying. Oh, I thought that might have been able to produce, like, some ingredients or stuff that we needed. Well, I guess we can go and put it in... I don't know. Should we put it on here somewhere? Oh, I've already got one. I've got one on the shelf up there. What the hell? Oh, oh well. Now I know. Right, so this table down here can have some benches. We just need the other two that we're waiting on here. Do you know what we need? We need some tablecloths. Wait, hold on. Why is that? Oh, there we go. It wasn't in properly. That's better. I wonder why it was sticking out a bit. We also need some candles up in here when we do turn... Well, open the tavern up. What time are we on? We have need to sleep. Um, quickly, if I sleep and... If I do an order... Let's have a look. Furniture. Rope fence. Can we actually buy any tablecloth? I know we could do it with... Oh, Scarecrow. With the, with, want the snowman? The snowman sold them. Maybe we can't get normal ones. That's annoying. Hmm. Oh, look. You can actually buy the enchanted broom, if anyone's wondering. You can actually buy it as well, but you do get given one for free, so make sure you do that first. I guess it's if you ever you lose it or whatever, I don't know. Forging tank for metals. 
Yeah, the, I want like a nice table spread, but it seems like you can't get any. Cat! Okay, we're getting there. Yeah, it's still got the water. If I quickly take these out of here, we can put some more on before we sleep. Right, I'm gonna... What did I say I was gonna make? We needed to make porter, right? That's trending right now. Uh, what should we put in here? I don't even know what porter is properly. I don't know. Let's just put a little bit of something in there. Why not? Should we make it bitter? I'll do. Uh, I can't make any of this. Fuel. We need fuel in here. Oh my god. All that time. Now we can start making this stuff. So... We need more red grapes. Oh, okay, we need to buy some of those. Definitely need to buy those. I'm actually going to make some of this wheat bread because it was trending, right? Let's just make some wheat bread. Uh, what should we put in it? Just, I don't, I don't think it really matters. Make garlic bread? Garlic... With some herbs. Garlic and herb bread. Sounds nice to me. There's a stone pile as well, like the wood the wood one. Yeah, I think there is. I think we do need to get that, if I'm honest. Um, because we're not making as much stone blocks as we should be. So, yeah, you've reminded me. I think we should definitely do that. Look at this heart. The cat's so close. I will get you to full heart soon, my friend. Should we ch check the trends? Yeah, one day. So wheat bread's popular today. Things with onion in as well. So now, does this mean just selling onion directly on their own? Or does this mean having this included in all the recipes? It'd be a good test. Because I don't know, can you actually just put vegetables in here to sell? Let me ch Let me check. Why would someone come and want to buy an onion, though? <laughs> Let's get one onion and see if I can sell it. Imagine coming to a tavern, guys, and ordering one onion. No, you can't. So you can't actually put that in there. So it must be foods that include... that have onion in it, which is good. And it seems like we've got a lot of stuff with that. Right, let's put that in there. There's the savoury pie. Oh, do we need this for a quest? I think we did. I'll actually go and check that quickly. Yeah, it's included in the recipe. That's good to know. So, orders. Right, we needed the savoury pie veggie. There we go. That one's done. Oh, some cup of tea with honey. Oh, that sounds amazing. We've got to, we've got to do some of that, guys. Right, the lager with the honey. That's what I needed. We're gonna need to order some of this honey. Now I wish you could produce this. I wish there was a beehive in the like a bee house in the game, and you could make your own honey. It seems like a popular ingredient. Let's do ten of that. So we need the lager with honey. Let's do that one now, and then the tea with honey. Right, there's the cup of tea. We'll put some honey in that. That's gonna be for the order. And then the lager with honey. There we go. Just put a bit of all sorts on here. I don't really know what we're going for, but uh, always keep them on the go. We can do a little bit more red wine. Not got any of that though. Right, can we store some things away? Raisin. I wish there was a button where you could directly send things from your inventory straight to the chest. You know, like Stardew Valley? Because it does 
take a little bit of time trying to figure out which chest has got what in, you know? But we'll get there, we'll get there. So let's take a look. So we've got some more saplings that we can plant. We'll go ahead and do when we get out. Um, that's the roast beef and the bread that we can go and put in. We've got the porter as well. That's trending. We've got the savory pie that we can also sell. Okay. We're looking good, guys. We're looking good. Let me go and put this in here. Boom, boom, boom. Now we need to fill this barrel up, porter, and we're going to pull it. We're going to get all the beer out. I love this sound effect. Is it too blurry, guys? What's the uh, quality like? If you click on the settings, you can change the quality to HD. Is everybody else having the problem? Does the, the quality look rubbish? It's saying it looks excellent for me. But I don't want the quality to be bad for you guys. I'm streaming in 1080. Yours is fine. Maybe it's just a little bit of internet speed for the person who's watching. It's clear to me. Okay. Oh, that's good then. I didn't want it to be blurry for everyone. That would have been awful. As long as you guys can see what I'm doing, hey? <laughs> Looks awesome. Oh, nice. Appreciate the feedback, guys. Guys, we are so close to 100 likes. Thank you so much. You guys are the best. Let's plant some more of these trees. Oh, look, they are growing, look. It's, it's looking good, guys. It's looking good. We're going to get some good wood here that we need. Massively, massively need. They, I think they, I think they, yeah, they have. They've definitely changed this. This used to be so hard to get. Wood was so rare in this game. But I feel like the trees are giving us a lot of saplings in return. Yeah, it's looking good for me. I like it. Let's knock some of this down, because you can't put a sapling down on top of grass. So clear this down. There is also an achievement you can get by siphoning down a lot of this grass, so <laughs> don't be afraid to do it, guys. Go out there and get it. Sadly, at the moment, though, the it doesn't give you anything in return. It'd be nice if it gave you some kind of random seeds, maybe, that you can plant, like mixed wild seeds, or even some kind of fiber that you can use to, to craft with or something. I don't know. It would be good to get something in return, some hay. In the next update, they are introducing farm animals. So I would not be surprised if this could actually turn into hay. I can't wait for that, guys. Farm animals in the next update. Just imagine... Being able to get milk and eggs from animals rather than having to buy them or order them. It's going to be insane. Right, we're going to get this stone and then I'm going to make a stone stockpile. So we can start creating more stone blocks. 114 likes. Yeah, you guys smashed it. I appreciate every single one of you who has smashed that like button. Right, let me get the stone down here as well. You've set it to 1080 HD, so that could be why as well. Yeah, if it is ever bl blurry. I've noticed sometimes, you know when I watch YouTube on my iPad, which I do quite a lot to be honest. It, YouTube has a, a thing where it automatically sets the... The quality is low. He never chooses the max that it could be. And even halfway through a video or a stream, it will turn it back down to like low. And it's so frustrating because I, I kind of want to watch it in full HD. Right, guys. There's the stone stop power, the block one. We need this. Oh, it's so much blocks though. But then, as you can see at the moment, we're only making two stone blocks per four stone. That's not very good. So this stone block is going to give us three every time we craft. Yeah, we need at least three or four of them. 100%. Um, that's just going to help us out massively. Definitely need to do that. Oh, what What the hell? I've got a stone stockpile inside there? Why is that in there for? 
<laughs> that is so weird. So we've already got one. Nice. Okay. Maybe I crafted this and completely forgot about it. But here we go. This is going to increase our output of stock blocks. Stone blocks. So what I'm going to do is cancel those. And now if I do them again... Oh, why is it still two? Block stockpile. Oh, it's took the stone out. So as you can see, it no longer takes four stone to make two stone blocks. It takes three stone. Interesting. That still helps, though. That still does help a lot. It's a little bit different to the wooden one. Right. We can actually make... Right, so we've got the two benches. Yeah, the tables are all done. So what I'm going to do now is just grind on the wooden planks, which we need to expand. Look at these. These shelves might be quite good to put decoration on around the tavern. Or even in the rooms as well, when we do the, uh, the guest room. A nice shelf would be really good. Coal stockpile as well. How do we make coal, though? Something I actually never do. We can make firewood, which is good. How do we make coal, guys? There it is. Oh, you need firewood to make coal. Okay. So I guess what we could do is maybe just have one of those. If we get one coal, just so we can make a little bit more coal. I don't know. It's quite important that we need the wood. It's only 15 planks. Let's do one of those, and then I'll make some firewood as well. And then we can start making our own coal rather than gathering it, because, you know, we need it for fuel. So, yeah, we can't complain at that, really. I'll just do one, though. We don't need to go too crazy with that for now. Let's store away some stuff. Uh, all the good stuff. Yep. More nails here. 84 nails right now. Let's go. Oh, there's the candle holders. We've got the shiny gold or copper ones now as well. So, here is where you upgrade your tavern. So you need to make sure the nails are in there, the mortar, the stone blocks, and the wooden planks. They're the four things you need to upgrade, as, as well as your gold. So now I'm just going to start grinding on all the things for that, I think. Uh, yeah, we've got some stone here that we can put away. So, stone blocks. Actually, we also need the stone blocks to make the mortar. Or the polished stones. God, yeah, stone's going to be quite quite tough. I think we've sorted the, uh, the wood situation out now, the planks. Now we need to focus... And the nails. Th to be honest, we make a lot of nails. It just seems to be the, the stone block. Uh, Peggy, check my comment about the porter. Oh, sorry. Uh, stout has historically enjoyed higher popularity than porter. The most specific difference between modern stout and porter is the type of dark grain used to make the wool. <laughs> Look at this, the knowledge. Peggy knows it all. I appreciate it. That's awesome to know. Love that. Right, we've now actually made some of the things for the orders. Pale Ale was also trending as well. Let's make uh, an orange and mango Pale Ale. And we'll have it... Quite aroma. Yeah. Or should we have it sweet? Yeah. A sweet Pale Ale. Let's try that. Google knows it all. <laughs> okay, so... The best thing is now we've got two more large benches that we need for our last table. So when we open up the tavern very soon, we've got a lot of seats for the the guests, the customers. We need another one though. One more snuck in here. Maybe two if we could. So hold on. Can I... I can't put that right up there, can we? Hmm. 
Yeah, it's not going to squeeze right up there. It's got to be down a little bit. That'll do. Right, let's go and check the orders because we have completed a few there. Did the Yeah, we've got the tea as well, right? Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. So there's the tea and there's the lager. Boom, boom. Look at that XP, guys. Wowzers. I don't think I... Roasted pork, roasted chicken. I'm going to wait till tomorrow, see if they change. You know what? We'll, we'll get rid of the uh, the roasted fish as well for now. Because we can accept free tomorrow. We're still waiting on the cabbage to grow, so... Let's get that water. Right, we need to put the candle holders down. We've got some more cup of tea that we can sell now as well. Right, let's see what we can do with these three. So, this table now needs one. Boom. The customers always complain if it's too dark, so you definitely need to add the candles on there. Let's, oh, let's get rid of that little candle. Let's pick it up, and then we'll put the candle holder on there like that. And then we'll put the candles in when it's time to open, because they do burn out eventually, so you don't want to put them down just yet. We've got to We're going to need some more candles soon as well. The cat. Oh, did you just get angry at me? Oh, no. You, you're doing all right. We're doing all right. Oh, God, he's so needy. I'm just going to spam the, the pet one. <laughs> get full hearts. Right, 2 p.m. We're going to open the tavern, I think, in the next one hour. Let me just check to see. Yeah, we've got these things now. Beautiful. So the coal stockpile. Can this go in any of these slots? Oh, it can go up here as well. That's good to know. Um, good, good, good. So now, when we actually make some coal from the firewood... We get six pieces instead of five. And all you need is just to use the firewood. And coal is better than firewood, of course. Lovely jubbly. Lovely jubbly. More nails. We're actually running low on, um, on coal as well. That's not good. Let's open the tavern. Sonia, welcome to the family. Thank you so much for the member. I really appreciate that. Oh, look. Our strawberries are done. And the raspberries. Which one do you prefer, guys? Let me know in the chat. Strawberries or raspberries? What kind of person are you? I, I actually love both of them, but I'm going to say strawberry on this one. I love a good strawberry. Oh, the garlic's done too. I love garlic. Yeah, let's see who wins. Raspberry or strawberry? My dad loves raspberries. They're his favourite fruit. Can you feed the cat? You cannot feed the cat, no. You can just pet him and give him water, and then you can buy the cat bed, which also helps with the art. You don't get the cat bed at the start, I don't think. I remember buying that. Strawberry, strawberry, strawberry. Raspberries, but I love them both. Okay. I love both, but I have to go with strawberries as well. Yeah, come on. It's, it's a no-brainer, right? It's got to be. It's got to be. Let's open the tavern. I think we've done enough on there for today. And we are going to open. Let's make some money, money. Oh, quickly. Let's clean the room. Oh, no. Someone might want to come in here to, inside the room today. They've left it in a state. The dirty buggers. Oh my god, what have they done? What have they been doing in this room? <laughs> oh, it's so dirty. Is that it? Is it cleaned? Yeah, I think that's it. I'm coming, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I totally forgot to clean the room. I'm here. Oh god. Boom, boom, boom. There we go. I'm back. 
Let's, we've actually got some, yeah, let's put the green tea in there. Let's make that moolah moolah. Let's shut that door. The cat's just roaming wild. Keeping the customers happy. <laughs> Pet him. You can choose the style of cat that you want when you first start the game. Uh, sadly, you can't choose a dog. I would definitely prefer a dog. But I do know the developers were asking on Twitter yesterday what other animals they want to see come to the game. And I do think dogs should be a part of that. Imagine being able to actually have the choice of choosing a cat or a dog that could uh, relax in the tavern with you. I know cats are more, you know, a bit more wild and maybe more medieval theme. You pros you know, you possibly would see cats inside taverns, but I'm a dog person. The candles, yeah, let's see. It's not getting too dark yet, so I don't think they're gonna be complaining just yet. But I'll put them down anyway. Let's make them happy. Oh guys, hold on. This area, I don't think people can go there. I feel like we need to make an area for the customers. Let's see if they go and sit on there. Yeah, they don't. So as you can see, this line here only stops there. I think we need to create a, a customer or like a, a guest area that I forgot to do. And that's why no one's sitting on that table. Completely forgot. So we're going to take a look at that after I've closed the tavern, just because we can't do it mid-serving mid right now. Yeah, that's my bad. Oh, we're getting rushed off our feet, though. Oh, we got achievement. Clean as a whistle. We must have cleaned a certain amount of uh, tables, which is good. Yeah, that's a bit annoying that we can't use that table in the back there. I'll create it as an open room so people can go in. Like, you don't need to light the fire until 8pm. That's when it starts getting dark and cold. You don't need to do it until then. Oh, someone's getting angry. Get out of here! Get out of my pub! Go on, do one! Right, I'll put the fire on now. It's just about getting 8 p.m. That's when they start complaining it's too cold then. It's just a waste of fuel otherwise. Now, this table down in the corner here, that's going to need a light. And so is this one down here. So, oh, sorry, I nearly whacked you in the face as you were leaving. There we go. Yeah, it's quite light now. They do complain of cold and dark. So you got to make sure we're on top of that all the time. Let's pet this cat. I want to... Oh, it's nearly there. Come on. Please. Table's dirty. What you ordered there? I think that was eggnog. There's the tea with the honey. Nice. What have we got left? Oh, they are rinsing for our products here. So there's the porter and the pale ale. The pale ale is nearly already gone. So you can see that it was trending. The pie that you guys made is selling so good. The turkey and vegetable pie. There's the last pale ale. I mean, I'm going to be sold out of it. Enjoy the last one, my guy. We're making some money now, guys. Ten gold. Yes, come on. Hello, Miku. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. I think people can't get to the bottom benches. Yeah, I've already, well, I've already spoke about it. Oh, you mean the bottom bench? Oh, of course. Yeah. Hold on. Let me test that out. Because it did let me put it there, though. Let me see what's going on with that. Because it lets you put them down there. Let me see. That's interesting. It wasn't blocked off. 
Let me have a look. Come on, someone go down. Kevin D with the membership. Thank you so much. Welcome to the family. I really do appreciate you. Yeah, no one is sitting on the bottom, right? We need to change that. We have messed up. Oh, my God. Uh, so maybe it's actually better to go the other way rather than what we've got now. Yeah, we, we, we're not making as much money because we've just not got... One table's out of use completely, and then all of those benches on the bottom is out. Out of order. Right, we should put last orders in, I reckon. Yeah, and let's try and sort that out for the next time. We'll see what we can do there. How are you doing, Kevin? I hope you've had a good day. It's good to see you in the stream. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is sort out this situation here with the um, with the tables because we've messed up, guys. We've messed up. So, let me have a look here. I feel like we need to go this way. This is probably going to help us out more. Because you could have one like that. Uh, maybe have that going. Oh, can we actually go through there, though? Let me check. Oh, we can. We can. So we could have it like that. And then this way, this can come up one. Like that. Maybe this is the layout. So we'll have one going up, one going cross. I mean, we could even have this one going cross as well. Let me just see how that looks. Kind of like that. And we can still come through there. Do you guys prefer that? Should we have them all going like that? Um, yeah, maybe let's try that. So these little tables can probably just come up here for now. Can you go there? No, you're interfering with the bar. Well, this is difficult when it's so small. I mean, we can expand this to make it a little bit bigger and better. But right now, it's tough, right? This is tough. So, let's also go... Can we go like that? Like that. And like that. Can we still go through? Yep, we can, as long as we can light the fire and get up to the rooms. Also, no one actually wanted to join the room this time. Oh, I know why. There's no candle. You've got to put a light source in there or they won't join. I'm going to sort out this area as well. Right, so what we're going to do, we're going to move that one away a second. I think this is a good layout. I think this is a lot better for us. What do you guys think? Yeah? Yeah, this is looking good, right? We should maybe buy a rug to go near in front of the fire. I think that would look cool. All right, yeah, this is this is much better. And look at the space that we're getting now. Um, and then we can kind of have these little... Yeah, maybe if we get one, two more benches here. And then we've got this, like... Hmm. Yeah, I think we can make that work. I like that. Right, so now we need to sort this room out. But I'm going to do that in the morning because we need to sleep. I think I know what I need to do with that. Rug plus fireplace would be a safety hazard. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> You're not wrong. Uh, we need empty kegs. Have we not got any empty kegs? Where are they all? You're telling me we've only got one keg? There's no way. I'll have a look at that in the morning. I think they might still be in the pumps. Right, the cat's still got water. Let's sleep. We're doing well so far, guys. How long have we been streaming? Like one hour and 20 something minutes? Yeah, we're doing good. Uh, how do you unlock eggs in the game? I'm so sorry I've missed your super chat, um, Stephen. Um, you can get eggs by the new stone golem. It's in the area at the south where the farm is, and there's a stone golem, and he'll sell eggs near enough every day because he's got a chicken friend called Nugget. You used to be able to order your eggs through the order form, but since this update, they've changed it, so you can actually buy them from the golem and the chicken instead. 
Hope that helps. I could show you what I, what I mean. I might go down there and have a look at the stock myself, and I can, I'll kind of show you what what I'm talking about. Right, so first of all, let's sort out the keg situation, because we need to make more beer. There's not a keg in that tap. There's not one in... The, where are they all gone? How have we... Only got one. I used to have like four or five. That is baffling. Uh, this table needs cleaning. Much help, thanks so much. Well, I hope it's helped you out. I'm glad it did. Let's uh, let's check in the chests. Where are all my kegs? Oh yeah, there's some of the Christmas stuff. I've got some seeds actually as well. Oh yeah, the fruit trees. We do need grapes. We've actually got six of them. I'll plant them right away. And we'll do the fruit trees as well. Let's do the pears. Oh, we'll plant the apples too. Why not? Hmm. You lose the kegs when you do... Sp oh, special orders. Yeah. I think you're right. Yeah, they don't give you the keg back, do they? Right, so we need to actually buy some of them. Holy crap. That's not good. Uh, let's sort this out, get all my stuff in there, all my ingredients. Raspberries and garlic and strawberries can't go in there, because there's no space. We need another chest. I'm going to get one of these large ones and put it in here and get rid of this small one. That's going to be a plan today. In improve the storage in here. Uh, we'll maybe craft one, because they can be quite pricey. And we don't want to do that. So let's put this keg in there for now. Pale Ale, and we'll go and order some more, and then we'll also sort out this situation with the the flooring. Uh, candle bra in the rented rooms, and you use the, the housekeeper to clean it. The housekeeper will put in a new candle each day. That's amazing. I think we should definitely do that. Thanks for the tip. That is cool. Uh, nails, no, we don't need those in there. wood so nails go in here all always stone blocks oh we've got another block stone pile of course let's get that straight in my basket I hope we can still squeeze through there though let's have a look so you can't get that way but you can come through there lovely right more stone blocks on the go. We're getting two every single one, and it's only costing two stone. And it used to cost us four stone. So we're saving two per one there. That is awesome. Let's mine some more of this. Uh, Sharky, any updates on Haunted Chocolatier? Not, not yet, sadly. Um, the only thing that we've had, like, this year is a screenshot from the developer, which was basically some of the chocolate designs, some of the actual little snacks and treats that you can producing the game which is pretty cool but that is all we've got uh, i'm waiting for a little bit more so i can do a full video on it and kind of you know figure out what we've got but so far nothing i guess he's just working hard on it at the moment i can't wait to see some more sneak peeks or some reveal it's gonna be good can't wait for that game I feel like I'm going to, that game's going to be great because it's going to remind me a lot of this game, Traveler's Rest, because you know you own your own tavern. Um, but whereas that game, you're going to own your own chocolate chocolatier. You're you know you're going to be baking goods and making treats and snacks and selling them to your customers, which is going to be so. I love games like that. You know, little simulators. So cool. Right, what do I need to do? What was I trying to figure out? Uh, I've lost my trail of thought. Let's plant these seeds first of all. That's definitely something we can do. Just put that away for now. We've got all the cabbage though, which is very, very good. Oh yeah, grapes are actually little... They're growing like trellises, don't they? So, we need a little bit more space. We've actually got some white ones as well. Nice! Let's get some apple and pear trees. We'll do one pear... One apple, kind of do it in order like this. There we go, and then we've got a little bit more space for some here. I 
Can we do maybe two more? We've got yeah, just enough. Look at that. Perfect. That's all gonna be growing nicely. These are the juniper berry bushes. Looking good. Right, there's all the stone blocks. They are yeah, we're doing good with those now. Bird fountain, good decoration. Let's keep making more of those though. We'll make some more iron bars as well. Anything that concerned eight makes at this point, I'll be excited about. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> A shining chandelier. Look at that. Might get some of those to put inside the tavern. I think they're going to be great. Especially for the, the rooms as well. Uh, yeah, that's what I wanted to do. So if we go over to this uh, building and we go Q. So how do we create a zone? I'm quite... Add floor, remove floor, decor, zones, dining zone. Can we just do that? Error max, what? Oh, we can only go that far? Oh, I think we need to improve it, right, with the reputation. Oh, no. Or... Two. Oh, there we go. That's perfect. So as you can see, we've actually got numbers at the bottom here. Um, so for the crafting, we've got 55, 55 zone slots. Whereas the brewing, with the dining is all gone now. But someone, or people will actually sit on that table now, which is good. We still need a few more at the bottom here. Um, it's kind of wasted for at the moment, because no one can actually dine there. But I think we did it. How's fatherhood treating you? It's doing, it's doing amazing, Kevin. Yeah, really... Uh, it's keeping me on my toes, that's for sure. <laughs> Tiring, stressful, but it's all worth it. My little boy, is, he's eight months old now. He's absolutely growing so fast every day, it's insane. They definitely grow fast, right? Let's go up to the, the other floor here. So now, crafting rooms. So we've got one crafting room here. This is the, the guest room. I don't think we can... Can we add another guest? So why do we only have... Dining and crafting. Can we actually not have another one of these zones, guys? Another room? Because I really want to do that. How do we do that? So we can add more floors. I want another zone. I don't think we can we can do it. Right, let's accept that for now. Do we need to unlock more with reputation? Oh, you need more rep... Okay, yeah. Thank you, Miku. I'm from Malaysia. How are you doing? You are watching from very far away. I appreciate you being here. I'm not going to try and attempt to pronounce your name because I'll just butcher it. Right, let's have a look. So we need kegs. That's one thing that I was going to do as well. Order some of those. Let's search for them. Four. All right, we're going to need at least five of them. Let's have a look at the order form as well. Pickles. Roast the pork and white wine with peach. That sounds pretty tasty. I'll do some of that. Look how much XP that gives us. Woohoo! Shall we do all of those? Yeah, why not? Right, so let's have a look. Spicy pickle. That sounds gorgeous as well. What the hell? Well, there's the honey. We need that. You need to put a rented door in the rented rooms. A rented door. And what, does that create the, the room? Of course, yeah, we do have the uh, the rented room doors. But I don't think we're going to have enough anyway. Um, if we extend this floor out here, as you can see, look how much money it costs. Absolutely insane. So then what do you need? Do you need... You don't have enough planks, look at that. We've already run out of planks. So 
So it's kind of going to be like that, right? And then you do your room. I, I totally forgot how to do these. And then do you put your door like there? I don't think we can do it yet anyway, but it's quite baffling. It's confusing. I, I, I can't remember how we did this little guest room here. But when we've got a, a level... So let's have a look. Reputation. Next reward is events. What the hell does that mean? Change the one door into a rented door. We've already got a rented door on that one. We need planks. Let me just go and create some more of these um, because we are running low on them. There we go. So this door here, as you can see, is already a rented door on that room. That's what they look like. This room here is a crafting room. It's got a special zone. It's blue. And this is where we can use this room as crafting. Raw, you can't use it as a guest room. I mean, you could remove the zone, I guess, like this. And then now this room's empty. But it still doesn't give us the option to actually create a guest room. It's not down here. I think we need to unlock it. So, at the moment, yeah, to, to be honest, this could have... When we can unlock it, I'm going to make this as a guest room. Because I don't really use that at the moment. It's just a waste. So, we'll leave that as an empty room right now, and then we'll turn that into a guest room eventually, when we can. Yeah, that one does need a candle. When I open the tavern, I'm going to put a candle in, otherwise it'll just burn out, right? So, let me have a look. I need spicy pickle, roast pork with thyme, and peach wine. You need to hinge the door. What does that mean? Hinge? Go to the doors... Erase the one that's already there and exchange it with a guest room door. I'll try it. I'll try it out. So we need to remove that door. Oh. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Oh, I see, I see what you mean. So it's just all to do with the door. All right. So we can create these rooms. You don't need the zones. You just need the door. The door changes the zone, of course. And how much does it cost for the door? It's 15 planks and 10 nails. Okay, it's quite expensive for the door. All right, I get it, guys. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> all right, so yeah. We can accept that. We've got another room. We just need to decorate it now, okay? So let's work on that. Let's actually craft some stuff. Um, right, we've got the planks. I can actually put those in there now. That was baffling. So, we can put a closet in there. We just need... everything. <laughs> Right, guys, let me know what you want to put in this room, okay? I'm going to take all the resources that we can. The hinges, let me, let me get the hinges. What do you want to see in this room? Give me some suggestions. I think we do actually have some hinges already. Uh, four. Oh, we're going to need more than that, I think. We're going to need more than that. Let's put some on the go. So, yeah, of course we need a bed. Uh, you can craft kegs at the workbench as well. Yeah, the door changes the own. I need to... Right, so... Let's see what we can do. Do we have to buy the beds? Can we not craft them? I feel like this room's going to have a closet in there. Do you reckon that's smart? That's quite expensive, though. And maybe a, a bedside table? Yeah, we've got to have a bedside table. There's the big chest that I wanted as well. To improve the storage. Yeah, let's get the wardrobe. And then we just need some planks and hinges. I'm going to do a little window in there as well. We might have to buy some things. Let's put a little small shelf in there as well. 
to put some things on. More planks. Let's get those iron sheets. Do, do you need iron sheets for the hinges? Yeah. So we'll see what we can buy as well. Let's see if in the so we're gonna need a bed. There we go. I have to order one of those. A little bedside table. Cat bed. Right, guys. Here we go. We can buy some stuff here. What colour rug should we go with? Blue. There is purple, red. So purple, red, or blue. What rug do you want to go with? Do you need? A, do you actually need a stool? Do a purple one. Okay. Someone said. Should we go with the shaggy one or the purple or uh, the basic? Let me know which one you want. Shaggy or basic? Shaggy. Okay. What about decoration? Should we get a cactus? What kind of flower? A lily? Can kind of go with the, the purple colour. Is there anything else that matches that colour? We've got a paint in here. I think you can actually change those as well. Cactus, yeah, let's get the cactus. I think that's a good shout. What else have we got? Uh, we need something to put on the shelf. Because we have got one of those. Um, we're going to need a candle holder. I'm actually going to put one of these chandeliers in there. So don't worry about that. We're going to need... I don't want to... I can craft a small wooden window. But you know what? I'm not going to do it. Should we get a teddy bear? Yeah, let's get a teddy bear. We've got to do that. And then I think we'll get some kind of flowers or something. These here, maybe to put on, on the shelf. Or an incense burner might be good. The comfier the room, the higher the rent, the more profitable. Alright, so we basically put all sorts in there, yeah? Just go crazy with it. We could get a book. Let's get a painting and we can customise. Put that on the wall. Did I get the, yeah, the small window? Let's put a big shelf in there instead of a small one as well. Let's try that. That's gonna when that order comes, we'll decorate that room. And that's gonna be good, good, good. So we've actually got those chandeliers that I need. There's so much to this game. There's a lot to do. It's craziness. Craziness. Right, the, we've got a little shelf coming as well. I can use that for the other room, I think. Uh, why are these? Are these making? Oh, yeah, they are. We've got a little bedside table. So maybe we can put something on there. And then the wardrobe. That's going to look so cool. Let's have a look at some skill points that we've got right now. Because we've got 8 blue points, 15 green. Um... We've basically got everything. There's just a few more things. And I think we need the reputation. Let's go with that and that. Advanced lager. Um, we need to be level 12 to get distilling. And level 11, I think, for the cheese. Yeah, so we've got a few more of that stuff. That's good. Here we go. 233 XP. What should we go with? Should we make ourselves clean faster? Uh, craft faster? Uh, have a better yield of farming or bartending so we can serve faster and run faster, guys. What do you want to see? You can put the teddy on the bed. Oh, that's awesome. We'll do that. This is one of them games you can play for hours at a time, like Stardew. So much to do. It's so true. Uh, Miku said craft faster. You know what? That's not a bad idea, is it? Because we are crafting quite a lot at the moment. And our yield's higher as well. Yeah, you know what? You was the first suggestion. Let's go with that. That is a smart choice. I feel like you're advanced in this game, Miku. <laughs> You've played this a lot, right? 
I want to wait for that wardrobe and the orders to come. So while we're doing that, what I'm going to do... We've now got stone blocks as well. Let's put those away, because we're going to need those to make... Oh, we also need some stone in general. So it's time to gather some stone, and we're going to go and see Gollum, Nugget, and... Um, Bob, Bob and Nugget. And we're going to see what stock they have got for sale today, whilst we get the stone. It took you over 300 hours to get 100% completion. I mean, you know, you're taking your time. It's cozy. You don't want to rush through it. It took me hours and hours and hours to complete my main save file because I wasn't really going for the completion, you know? I was just enjoying the game. I mean, if, unless you're hunting for perfection and you're doing it from start to finish, then of course you can probably get it done rather fast. But that's the, the, the beauty of a cozy game like Stardew Valley. Just take your time, there's no rush. It doesn't really benefit to complete it any faster. Oh, we've got the wardrobe and the small shelf. I can't wait to de decorate this room, guys. It's gonna be awesome. It would be cool if this golem here, Bob and Nugget, sold like unique decoration furniture items. That'd be so good. Turkey time! Burr, burr. I'm sorry, I didn't want to do it, but I've got to. It's your fault you got me addicted. <laughs> and now you know more than me. I just like showing cool, awesome, cozy games to you guys, you know? All oh, the orders been delivered. Let's go. Are you still unpacking? When did, when do you finish? My God. I'll come and speak to you when I've finished. Yeah, that's been so long. What the hell's going on? Right, come on, Gollum, what you got? There's the eggs. This time he's selling more. Oh. See, the guys, the developers have listened. They're making it easier to get wood. Come on. Can we get this stone here? Oh, we can. It's a nice little... Stone block here. I'll need to remember that one every day. You've got me obsessed with this game and Graveyard Keeper. <laughs> it's not my fault, guys. I was already addicted to this game. The game got me too. Graveyard Keeper and this one. It's took over you as well. It's going to take ev over everybody. <laughs> it's going to control our brains. See, and, that, and that's why I like grindy games. There's a lot of people who hate games like this, you know, where they grind it and you have to work hard just to get a little thing finished. But in my opinion, that's what makes it fun and addicting, is the fact that it, it keeps you playing. Look how long it's taken us just to make money. We had 11 gold. We've already down to two now. <laughs> you know, just upgrading, getting bigger, making more money, unlocking new things. It's just, I love it. Grindy, grindy games are the best. They really are. People, some people hate them. I remember, you know, some people have played Graveyard Keeper and after one or two hours, they're like, nope, not playing this game. I hate it. It's so grindy and repetitive. It takes so long to advance, but just give it time because it gets good. Grind is life. Keeps you playing. Imagine, you know, playing a game. Three hours later, you've completed it. Nothing to do. It's just so easy, it's done. Whereas games like this and Graveyard Keeper, they'll keep you playing for hours and hours and hours. I wouldn't say Stardew Valley. Would you say Stardew Valley's grindy, guys? I don't think it's a grindy game, right? The thing is with Stardew Valley, it's more relaxing. It's a slow-paced game, and I think that's why it's addicting and it keeps you playing. I don't think it's grindy, because you can make money pretty fast. And you can kind of advance through the game speedy, if you really tried. I don't know. It is grindy in a crafty, fun way. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't say it's completely grindy like this game. Okay, we've got 28 pieces of stone there. That's much better. 
Our order has come, so we are going to go and decorate right now. I quickly just want to plant these uh, saplings. I want that wood coming in all the time. I think it's important to get these planted as soon as you can. We've cleared this space up here now as well with uh, all of that grass that we had. Yeah, let's go. This is what we want. This is what we want. More wood coming in. Some of the trees are growing nicely already. That's good. Let's get that water. Right, guys, I think it's time to collect our order. Nope, wrong one. And let's go and finish this room. More honey's come. Oh, I only took one out. That's my bad. Oh, look at all this. Look at the goodies. <laughs> look at the goodies. Oh, I don't even know where to start right now. Oh, okay. Windows, definitely, and wardrobe. Uh, I'm going to do the candles as well. They're important because they want the light. Let's go. Let's go and have a look. I discovered Sharky years ago when I was looking up tips and tricks to make money in Stardew. Oh, time has flew since then. Damn. So this is the new room. We need to change the stone floor. I think we need to change that. That's not going to work out in the long run. Uh, so first of all, let's get one of these little candle things. Uh, we need to create that light. How big is the wardrobe? Oh, that's cute. I love that. And then that could go there next to it, and then the bed in the corner. Maybe let's actually let's change it a little bit. Let's swap sides. Let's have the bed on this side this time. Uh, and the sh oh my god, look how big that shelf is. <laughs> That is... Oh, you can actually have it right there like that. Oh, yes. Oh, the window. Damn. Uh, let's put the window in this room. Because it's not got one. We can rotate it that side, which is good. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Let's go. That also needs one of these candle things. Because then we can warm that up. And light it up as well. Uh, let's have a look. So we need to go into inventory. We've got the purple rug, the bed, of course, the teddy bear, uh, some things for the shelf. In fact, let's get this little shelf here in this room. Can we put it above the bed, maybe? Let's put the, the painting like that and then the shelf like that. Oh, yeah. Come on, then. Hoo-hoo. Oh, the teddy bear can go on the bed, but it's going to go in this room. Right, there it is. Let's, can we? I wish you could change the bed in, like different colours. That would be super cool. Alright, the teddy's going on this one. That's amazing. And then we're going to have the purple... Oh, God, this is big. <laughs> this is looking good. This is looking good. Let's get the candles on. I need to see. It's getting cold. Oh no, I've, I've accidentally opened the tavern. What the hell what have I just done? <laughs> One person's coming. I pressed the wrong button. Oops. And now you're complaining you're cold as well. You can be cold. I don't care. Okay, I do care. So cute, looks good. When this customer's gone, we'll carry on, guys. I accidentally pressed O on the uh, on the keyboard, and it opens the tavern. There we go. <laughs> Got a little bit of reputation. Let's turn that fire back off. And let's go and finish what we started. Oh, look how nice that room looks. It's looking amazing. We've still got some other stuff, though. We've got the indoor cactus, the incense burn, the flowers, and the book to put on the shelf. Yeah, look at this, man. Uh, this game is so relaxing. Come on. I want to be able to see the cactus. Should we put it uh, where? Should we put it? The side of the bed? No. I don't want it in the corner because it's hard to see. I can't put books on there. They have to be on the tables. 
I think what we have... Haven't we got a little bedside table that's come in? Oh, yeah, we've got it. It's right there. So I think what we need to do, guys, is... Rem well, not remove that, but just put that down here in the corner. Have the little bedside table. Oh, that's cute. Look how small that is. And then have the book on it. Oh, it doesn't fit on there. Hmm. Painting. Uh, oh, you can change the style of this. Look at that. Is there any, like, purplish colours? No. So let's move this shelf down a little bit. Have the painting like that. Yeah, this is looking good. Uh, yeah, we just can't put anything on that table that we've got at the moment. We just need to go and get some more decoration for the shelves and stuff like that. You need a table and chair in the room anyway. Let's have a look. What does it say? Oh, we do need a table and a chair. Of course, like that one there. So I think we should get a table in this corner here that they can sit on. So that room's looking all good. What about this one? What do we need in here? Is this one okay? Yeah. Right, so let's get a table and chair then. That's looking good though. So in order for a customer to go in there and be happy, you do need to have a table and chair somewhere for them to sit. So I think we could get that in the corner. I think if we move this candle like in the corner like that, uh, in the corner there, the cactus can just maybe chill there near the bedside table, and then we'll have a nice table and chair in the corner. I don't know what to put on the side of that bedside table. We'll have a look. There's not much little pieces that you can put down on the shelves and things, which is a bit annoying, but can you? I don't think you can put the cactus on the table, right? No, you can't do that. It's a standing one. We'll have a look see if there's any little plants, though. We've got the book ready for the table. Let me see if I can craft one quickly. We just need a small table. Something not too big. Damn it. We need this one here, and we just need... Oh, planks and nails. I've already got them. They're in here. So if I create a small table, and then we need a stool, right? A small bench. Where's the stools? There it is. We can get a little stool. And then I quickly want to see if there's anything that we can craft to put on the shelves. We've got more of these incense burners. Oh, guys, we can make these things here. Decorative swords. We can get a little cup. A metal jug. That might be good on this bedside table. Let's do that. Let's see if there's anything else we can order. Uh, brazier book. We've got that. Candle holder. The cow skull. Cobwebs. There's a little small photo here. There's the horn. A good way to serve me. That might be quite good to to put on there. There's a lantern as well. The oil lamp. Oh yeah, this little pen. That'd be a good little decorative item. Is there anything else? Teddy bear, the vase. Yeah, there's not much. There's not much. I think that'd be okay. Will a candle holder go on that bedside table? I think, it, yeah, it definitely will. But I'm going to... Because we've already got the big candles. And they only need one light source. I think I'm going to try and put something else on there. Right. Let's make some lager. Uh, I'm just... Literally, guys, I've just clicked on anything that I saw. <laughs> it's a random one. Right, we need the spicy pickle. There it is. I know we needed that. Uh, oh, what else do we need? Can we check orders? I think it's up here, right? Yeah. The white... Oh, we should have done that. Right, roasted pork with thyme. We can't do that because we're doing that one. It's nearly done, though, already. Let's do that one. Oh, there we go. Right, roasted pork with thyme. Roast 
pork. There's beef, roasted pork. That's the one. Yep. And then they want thyme. Guys, we've not got any. Oh no. Yeah, we do. I lied. <laughs> nice. The cat is nearly full of hearts. What the hell? We need to decorate our room. Look at this. It's absolutely rubbish. Let's give us some light. We need something as well. What's all that about, guys? Can't forget about ourselves. Can we not put that in there? Yeah, there we go. There we go. A sack for the cat? What does the sack do? Is that actually a thing? Oh, the order's been delivered. Does it make him happy? Nothing. <laughs> just to, Let's just throw him in there. Let's ditch him in the river. No, I'm, so, I'm sorry. That's harsh, all right. I don't like cats, but that's that's taking it too far. <laughs> hey, if it was Graveyard Keeper, you could do that. Chuck anything in the river. No one ever saw. Okay, let's see if... So, the order's been delivered, and we've now also got... The thing that we've crafted. I've got that little thing. Let's go and do this order. Boom, 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 boom. Achievement. A local supplier. Honey in soup. That sounds disgusting. IPA. Sweet IPA. That should be easy. Don't forget the peach wine. Yeah, we'll do that as well. We've also got the IPA to do afterwards. I'm going to get this stone whilst I'm here. Honey sausage is weird too. I tell you, honey is used so much in this. I do like honey though. Honey's delicious. Look at them trees growing. Oh, they're like diamonds. Ooh, look. We've got the juniper berries. I don't know what we could use these for. We can put them in all sorts, really. I've actually never ate these in my life. I don't even know what they taste like. I can imagine them being quite sour. <laughs> they are, I'm pretty sure they're like a winter berry. So I can't imagine them being sweet, if I'm honest. Oh my god, look at this! A small bronze eye, and whatever that is. Distilleries right there. We just need some fuel in here. I might... That's a little bit of a decorative touch. Why not? Let's try it out. I've never crafted it before. Right. Nails. I need those in the other chest. Let's see what we can put away here. Because we're looking a little bit unorganised. Got random stuff everywhere. Planks. Nope. Wrong one. This one. And nails. We need to work on this stone a little bit more as well. Let's get some started. Um, the bird fountain looks cool, but I just don't think it's got any purpose right now. Stone blocks. Give us the good stuff. Then we need just that polished stone. Okay, I'll put that stone away for now in there as well. 24 pieces. That's not too bad. We need a bit more of that, though. Got some of the decorative things, the pickle that we can sell, cabbages that need to get stored away. There's that lager that we can go and sell. Alright, so we need to go back into the tavern. These aren't quite ready yet. Then we need to sort this room out as well, get some more tables and chairs in there because it's looking a bit all over the place. Oh, we need to pull the beer. I forgot we've got. Two kegs full of beer there. Roasted pork with thyme. We've got some of that to sell. Um, let's put some things away. Wow! 
Right, no space for any of that. Oh, we do need that other chest. I don't think... Oh, we're not going to be able to store anything, are we? Oh, crap. Yeah, this is not good. We need another big chest. Ah! Honey can go there. Turkey go there. We just need something for these cabbage and berries. We'll have to work on that. 100%. Let's go to this room and finish off some of the... We've got the table now, so this is going to be available. That's, that room's looking amazing, by the way. I love that one. Okay. Let's see what we can do. There's the small table. Guys, it's huge! No, we can't have that. Uh, <laughs> it said small. We need this one. I think it's called individual. Look how small this looks on here, by the way. On the picture, that looks like that. That, that's not right. They need to change the icon. I think I'm going to swap it with this one here. Yeah, we're going to pick that up. And then that can go there instead. I can't believe it. So we'll have that one go in there for now. There's the other stool. Craziness. That was huge. Let's put some of these coasters on this table. They stop the table getting dirty as much. We need to sort all this out. It looks horrible. Um, I don't know if I like them close together like that. I like being able to move between them. Alright, let's see now. This should be smaller. It's same as this one, I think. It's called individual, right? Yeah, that's the one that we need. <laughs> oh, that's craziness. Uh, so it can't go there. It's got to go like that. And then we'll have the stool that can go there. And then we can either put a book on there. Or we can put both on there, really. Yeah, let's... Have a place for someone to come and sit, do some writing or reading. They can have a candle holder as well. This jug can go on the... Oh, look at that. It's actually filled. You can change the style, guys. You can have it half empty, half filled, or full. That's cool. And then we'll rotate that, and we'll have that on the bedside table. Like they've had a little drink. Let's go. Should we have it, like, half like that? Yeah, that's better. What do you guys think to that room? I think that is done. That's a job well done, in my opinion. The telly would scare me too much if I rented that room. <laughs> yeah, well, someone's going to love it. Can you actually put it on the shelf? No, you can't. It can go on the floor or on the bed. I think it looks good, though. We can maybe put it on the bottom of the bed somewhere, can we? No, it has to be quiet. We'll leave it like that. Yeah, it looks cool. It's better than this first one, definitely. I mean, they're, they're both a bit different. Uh, we've got a stool, and that's it. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll put this candle into the candle holder. Um, oh, actually, we need two. Why not? And I'm going to order some more of these. We need them big time. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. I think they look incredible. You know what? I'm going to keep the stone floor on this one to make them look a little bit different. I was going to put the wood down, but... I'm going to keep it like that. So that's two rooms for guests that can come. Um, can I actually put a candle on there? Or has it already got one? I think it's got one already. Yeah, that's good. So if we open up the tavern, which we're definitely going to do. What time is it right now? Saturday. Ah, oh, it's still morning time. Let's maybe work on... Oh, your heart's gone down again, I swear. What the hell's going on? I pet him every time I see him. Right, we need some candles. These things aren't cheap, though, if I'm right. How much are they? Three silver for one. Yeah, money's running low already. Let's get, let's get 20. We're going to need so much of these. Right, we need to do the wine and the... Yeah, the orders. We need the peach white wine, if I'm right. Which we can probably do now. 
Yeah, so this is, so IPA's got a box on it and this. White wine and then we need peach. Are we, oh, I don't think we've got peaches, guys. We can't do that order. We've not grew any peaches yet. IPA, what does, what do they want on this one again? Sweet, anything sweet. We'll have to do this one first. Right, so strawberry sweet, right? No, that's fruity. Honey, yeah. Of course. So let's maybe buy some peach trees or whatever, because we've not got any of that, and that's going to be needed. That gives us a lot of XP, so we do need that, really. Let's see if we can get any peach seeds. All right, here we go. Let's grow some. Let's go with 20. It's quite cheap to get the seeds in this game. All right, we've got some of those. Iron bars, nice. Um, let's do more nails. More planks, as always. Oh, we get 11 from one now. Why is that? Oh, a skill. We leveled up our skill, which gives us better crafting. And look at that. We get 11 planks now from four wood. Oh, no, it's two wood. <laughs> oh, it's so good. I used to struggle getting that, and now I don't. Right, I'll put away this stool for now. We're not going to need that one just yet. We've got three empty kegs, which is good. Right, this is what we need to work on, guys. The chest. This is what we need. So we need 30 planks, 10 nails, and hinges. Let's have a look, see if we've got enough of this right now. Because we need it so bad. Bum, 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 bum. And this is going to be put into... <sighs> More planks. Damn you! Can we do it now? Yes! We need that large one, big time. Right, I think what we should do is go out and gather some resources. We need stone again, big time. Maybe some coal. You get several benches, tables and stuff from crafting. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, we need the benches for the tables. I'm going to work on the planks and then we'll go ahead and do it. Uh... Yeah, we need lots of these things. We've only got two pieces of wood. No! Look at all this forestry waste that's just lying around. Was the large ones? Which ones did we need? Were they small or large? I can't remember which ones they were. Yeah, they're smaller. So we need one, two, three small benches. Okay. Let's do it. There's our planks. There's a chest. Oh, we're getting there, guys. Right. One, two. <sighs> we need more planks again. This is what I'm saying. These, these things are like diamonds. You need them so bad. We need to chop some trees down. And I don't think any of these are ready. No, these are. Yeah, these are big. Let's go. Hey Sharky, uh, are we able to like forest the area below our inn? Are we able to... I don't know what you mean. Uh, below our inn, the next zone below I mean where the snowman used to be. Uh, what do you mean? Can you live there or, or what? What? Oh, I think the cat was unhappy again. Oh, replant as a forest. Uh, no, you can't. I don't think. I'll, I will check, but I'm pretty sure you can't do that. We actually do have uh, a, a sapling here. So we'll go and have a look. But I think you can only plant trees on this area. You don't need to make more benches. Oh, yeah, because we've got the skill, right? We can make more benches every time we craft. Which, well, we're going to need them eventually, so why not? You can use the forest to waste fuel. Yeah, I know, yeah. This game is only available for PC right now, but they are working for a Switch release. Eventually. Uh. 
All is delivered. Now, where's the big trees? I think they're still growing. Are these clusters big? Yeah, they're bigger than them ones, aren't they? Thank you so much, guys, for 155 likes. You guys are awesome. That is so good. That's amazing. Thank you so much. The support is incredible. That's a lot of likes for a stream. Right, no empty kegs. Okay, let's take a look what the order was again. I think it was the... Uh, oh. I always press that one by accident. Yeah, there's peach seeds and the candles. So we can go ahead and plant those right away. Um, and also the saplings that we've got. I will just experiment. You can plant here, if this is what you're looking at. You can put all the trees down here. But the bit where down here, I don't think you can do. No, you can't. But all of this space you can use. Them, them. There we go. More trees on the grow. Peach seeds. Let's put them down. Oh, these are big trees. Of course they are. We're not going to have enough space, enough space for them. That's going to have to do. I bought way too many of them, but it is what it is. For now, I'm just going to keep them in this chest, just because. Just because. Right. We've got a bit more wood, though. So you've got a lot of this stuff that we can use for fuel. It only gives you one, though. Whereas, look at the coal. It gives you 20. Insane. So, we actually got some... No, we only got two benches. I crafted two and we got two. So you don't get a bonus one, so whoever said that. Let's get loads of more of those on the go now that we've got the wood. And we'll also sort out the stone. The stone situation. Right, injures, nails, iron bars. Yep, 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 yep. All good, good, good stuff. Stone. Can we make more? So we need as much stone blocks as possible because if we want to make these polished stones. Oh no, we just need normal stone for those. We need stone blocks for mortar. Yeah, that's right. So let's make some of these this time. The polished stone. Because we need that for this. And we need that to expand. Alright, so we've got the benches now. Let's go and put those down. We can open the tavern. It's, yeah, let's open the tavern, make some money, because we are running quite low now. And we've got two rooms available, so hopefully we can get two guests to come and stay in there today. Oh, we still need one more bench, don't we? Damn it. Oh. <laughs> one table's only got one bench. I think that's going to have to do... I will craft another one anyway, just in case. We might be able to get it in time. Iron nails, iron nails. We should maybe put some nails in in the chest over on that side, to be honest. I feel like we need the nails in here. We craft a lot with them. So now we should be able to, yeah. There we go. One more of those. That's gonna take a little bit of time I might quickly whiz out and get it when it's done but let's open up the tavern Boom! there we go we're open fire goes on in like one or two hours we've got no candles on this one though I've got no candle holders this one might just have to sit without let's put that one up there That's okay. That will do. Alright, give me some money. We need it. <laughs> uh, have we got anything that we need to put in there? No. Oh, there's that chest. We need to go ahead and do that. I can quickly put this in. 
Why we've got a bit of time. Oh, tavern's got to be closed. You. Fine. The cat's behind the bar. <laughs> the cat's serving the people. Oh, there we go, guys. Look at this. So room one's got 57 uh, comfort and 53 for rent too. So they're both clean. Let's put you in there. Yes, we've got our first guest. One more room to go. And look, guys. They're actually sitting over on this side now as well. We've sorted that situation out. Really good. Right, the lights are kicking in. Oh, there's the second room. Yes. Oh, we can haggle. Oh, God, I forgot what to do. I forgot what to do. Oh, okay. Ooh. Yes, let's go. I think we got it, more money out of them, right? I keep forgetting you can do that. So I think we got more rent out of them. That was amazing. <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Why do you... Oh, it's in the pump. I forgot to pull them. Oh, this is never good. They're going to ask for those. We have to pump them every time. I forgot to pull it. Let's try and empty them quick. Is everything... Oh, table's dirty as well. I was not prepared for this. At least we got more rent from the guests, though. Let's get all of this stuff, all the pale ale, because they are asking for it, as you can see. Nearly done. Yes, done. Oh, the fire needs to go on. It's getting cold. There we go. Nice and warm for you guys now. Oh, God, you can definitely tell there's more people here. Oh, this is, this is quite hard. We should have got some staff. Get out. This is hard to manage on your own. Look at it. We're so busy. Just got to get all that lager as well. Let's empty that keg now. We don't need that one. Table's dirty down the bottom. Oh, on that one as well. Okay, I'm coming. Yeah, this is definitely more more frantic. Oh my god. But it's good. Money's coming in. It's getting lively. We're definitely expanding now. It's good to see. We still can get a few more tables in here though. Oh, someone's kicking off again. Calm down, please. Why are they not happy? I've tried my best. I'm doing all this on my own, you know. You can't please everyone, can you? The table down here is dirty. Let's serve them too. Oh. Okay. Oh, God. Look at them all coming for stuff. <laughs> they don't stop. Right, that's that one done. There we go. Oh, that one's dirty over there as well. Well, it's definitely lit up. I think the lighting's good. The heating's on. The two rooms are filled. Yeah, well, this is... Everyone's sitting down. There's just one table without a bench here on this one. So we are losing two customers here, but that's fine. Wow. This is so much more lively. I could hire someone for a couple of, a couple of hours, but you know what? I like it. It keeps me busy. I don't like just sitting there. Sometimes I don't mind, but as we grow and get a bit bigger, I'm definitely going to hire staff all the time when it becomes like impossible to do on my own. But I think at the moment we're okay. I can manage it. I'm a lot faster. I'm faster at serving. I'm faster at cleaning. We've got the magic broom, which really helps a lot. I think we're okay. I'm getting to save money because you have to pay people, you know, staff. I don't think we're doing too bad, guys. Let me put all this uh, pale ale into there. Oh, look at all that stuff, guys. It's nearly gone. <laughs> we can't open for a little while. We need to stock up. I think the next couple of days are going to be making production, making beer, wine, lots of food. Because at the minute, we're just making a lot of stuff for the orders on the order form outside. Uh... 
Oh, we still need to pull this. Of course we do. That's why you're asking for it. I didn't empty it. I forgot. Oh my god, this is crazy. The tables are filthy as well. Ah. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh my god. Look how much work this is. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I smoked too soon. I was like, yeah, this is easy. We can manage. I'm all good. Yeah, I'm going to get another brewing tank and we're going to make double the amount of beer every time rather than waiting for one. That's the next step. We need to work on production right now and fill out this uh, this menu so then we can just open for like days on end without worrying. There's a lot to do still. We can still get at least two or three tables in here as well to fully maximize the space. What time are we on? Midnight. Yeah, last order soon. Because I think we're running low on products, if I'm honest. Look at that. A little bit of food, a little bit of beer, and that's it. They are drinking us dry. Right, when we fill out again, last orders, I think. When everyone's come through here and all the tables are looking good. Oh, I've got a pull. That's the last one for you. Someone's kicking off. This is not the right time. Thank you, the calm down. Right, last orders. I can't handle it. Let's get all them. There we go, last orders. Whoo, God, that was wild. But look how much money we made, though. We're nearly on 10 gold, and I'm hoping we can get close to level 9 reputation. Come on. You got this, says Abby. Yes, <laughs> we got it. Look at them all go. Look at that reputation going up. Come on. No, we're so close to level 9. I think we need to open one more time, don't we? Oi, 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 oi. Oh, that was crazy, though. But we've got good XP, good reputation, good money. Yeah, this is what we need, guys. We need another um, fermentation tank and maybe another brewing barrel as well so we can just get like two get things on the go every time. Um, otherwise, it's going to be hard to make a lot of money or beer. We need to get working on some food. So I think I'm just going to start... These chocolate logs are amazing. I used to make a lot of money from them. So I'm going to work on them again. Now we can get the other... The other chest here. So I think what I'm going to do... Oh, we're getting tired though. We'll do it in the morning. I'm going to empty that small chest. And put it into the new big one. Banging trade that is for a Saturday night. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> the cat all looks low. I know, thief. I don't know what's going on. I pet him every time I see him. His water bowl is filled. Why can I not get this full heart with this damn cat? I try my best every time. It, it seems like it's going lower. I, honestly, I, no, I don't know what else to do. I try my best and it just doesn't work. <laughs> Oh, it's so frustrating. This damn ginger cat. You're so needy. You take so long to bloody get affection with. Ah, that was perfect. So what I'm going to do is we're going to empty this one. And we'll swap it out. Because I need to move it anyway. I don't like the location of it. Uh, oh. Oh, no. Can we actually get this back up? Yeah, we can. Okay, so... Where do we put these? The space is so hard here. Let's move things in the corner as much as we can. We need to kind of... It's kind of have... No, that's not going to go there like that, is it? These need to go on the bottom. 
maybe have a big chest there. And then, ooh, oh, the people left the room. Nice. Can you actually get into both of them? Oh, we can. That's cool. Right, guys. All right, cabbage can go away. Can we get any of this stuff away in this chest? Does it stack? I wish there was a button for this, but there's not. No. But anyway, look at this. We're looking good. Lots of space now. Nope, we need those to sell. Yes, come on. We have got a small chest still. I felt like maybe we can keep this maybe in our room and we can s store things there as well if we need to. Um, I think this big one's going to be fine. Right, guys, we need to work on some more of these tanks so we can make more. Um, yeah, let's do that, I think. We could expand this room as well to make it even bigger with the money that we've got. Do you guys think that's smart? Shall we, in instead of... Wait, can we actually improve that bit now as well, the zone? Do you think we should improve our crafting room? Shall we make it bigger so we can get more stuff? We've already got the second room. We don't need to do that for a while. So shall I upgrade this a little bit and come like down here with the money that we've got? Can the cat be upset about the cold? No, I don't think it does. Oh, there's the person. Thank you for stopping in your room. I bet you've left a horrible mess. Yeah, should we expand that? I feel like that might be a good idea. But look at these two cozy rooms, guys. I love these so much. We just need more, more furniture. We need different, different stuff to put in here. Because otherwise, they're all going to start looking the same, you know? So I do hope... Oh, we can use the wardrobe. We can use the goddamn wardrobe. Wow. I did not know that. That's incredible. Well, there we go, guys. We can get changed. Are these new clothing items as well? I don't remember seeing these. We can put some jeans on. Yeah, there's not much, but hey, look at us. We've had a little fresh trim. Oh, we're looking absolutely snazzy. A little plastic surgery and some new pants. <laughs> yes, I love that hairstyle. That is amazing. With the beard as well, he's looking, he looks like a bartender. A good, a good idea to expand the crafting area. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to spend our money on, guys. I love that we can actually use the uh, the closet. So it's actually not needed for this room. This has got 53 comfort. How do we improve that even more? It's actually a little bit low. Be nice to get 100 comfort in there. This one's 57. Hey Sharky, always enjoying your content. Thank you so much, Pineapple. I'm glad you could make the stream and I hope you're doing well. I appreciate the support, as always. Guys, thank you so much for 185 likes. Literally, that's almost like every viewer has hit that like button. <laughs> I really appreciate that. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. So let's in. So both of them rooms are cleaned. They're looking good for the next two people. Every time someone asks to go into the room, we need to haggle to try and get more rent from them. Can you put fireplaces in the room? Or some kind of heater? I don't think you can, no. But I don't think the fire or the heating actually matters in the rooms. Uh, they only need a light source. And I'm guessing the candles produce a little bit of heat as well. So yeah, let me... So what we're going to do... Let's work. We've got nine gold, so we can expand a little bit. It's not too much, but... It's definitely better than nothing. Oh, we've got the chocolate logs that I need to put in there. And the IPA now as well. Oh, wait, was that for the order? Yep. Now they're going to take my keg. I hate that. It's great XP. We'll do that one. I always accept the ones with a lot of XP. We could do some of these uh, shish kebab. They want it sweet, so they want honey on that as well. 
I might leave that though. I want to accept the big, big ones. Thank you to everyone who has subscribed, by the way, as well. They don't pop up on the stream, but I can hear it. So I do appreciate if you are a new subscriber. There's the other bench. Right, we're going to need lots of planks for the last time here. We're going to also need some mortar. Which we should be able to do now that we've got the polished stone. Yeah, and then let's expand as much as we can. We've got 10 gold. Hold on, why is that money just gone up, guys? What happened there? It was on 9 a second ago, but we're not opening the tavern. Where's that money come from? What the hell? That's crazy. I don't know where that's come from. The renter left? No, they, was already, they already both left. I was in the room. There was no one in there. Or was they still in there? I don't know. Oh, maybe they've left then. Um, let's have a look here. So what we need to do, if we want to expand, we need to put all the planks in there. We also need to put in the nails. Where are those? I'm hoping we've got some. I'll make some more as well, just in case. Oh, we've got no fuel. We need coal big time. Oh my god. Right, there's the planks. Perfect. Nails are in there. Nice. Put those in there. Put those in there. Look at the planks now. Let's go. And now we just need the mortar. Let's see how much I can make. Just two? Oh no, this is so tough. Right, we need more polished stone. This takes so long. I think while I'm waiting for that. Oh my god, we've got some crops as well. More strobes. I think we need to go and get more stone. The wood's okay at the moment. We need coal, 100%, and stone. Uh, Jay Flatterman, thank you so much for the, uh, the super chat. Great stream, Sharky. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I appreciate the support, as always. We're nearly on 200 likes. How is that possible? That is crazy. So we will not open the tavern today. We're just going to renovate it. We're going to work on it, all right? I don't think we need iron right now. Or copper. We just need stone and coal. Just found him recently going through his, a lot of his playlists. <laughs> That's, I love that. There's plenty on there. A lot for you. If you love games like Traveler's Rest, there's a lot similar to it. You know, we've got Graveyard Keeper, we've got Kinseed. Of course, Stardew Valley. There's lots like it. Cozy, relaxing, addicting games. Okay, that's good. Yes, we can make another three of them. This is what we like to see, guys. This is what we like to see. We're making moves. We can expand. We're working on that today. We're going to increase that crafting room. Let's go up and get that stone. Some coal there that I forgot about. There we go. Okay, so I know there's... I'm starting to get familiar with the stone spots now. Because they stay the same place. You can just get them a certain... Oh, there's some stone there. You can only get a certain amount of stone each day. It's magic. That boulder will reappear tomorrow. <laughs> Ooh. Nice apples. The cozy streamer king. Yes. You got the cozy vibes, guys, always. There's no stress here. We ain't got no time for stress. We have enough stress in our day-to-day -day lives. Right, 
I can't wait to see what's up there. That's going to get unblocked in a, a future update. Can't wait to see what that's going to be. And this as well, this bridge to go over here. You can see the potential of this. Where, like, There's so many new areas that they can unlock. Can't wait. This song that's on right now reminds me of... Um, you guys know. Pirates of the Caribbean. Like a pirate song. <laughs> You're totally looking forward to a mine. I think that would be amazing. If there is a mine system in this game where you can go and get your ores and stuff like that, maybe some enemies. Wow, that would take this game to a whole new level, right? And fishing. I really wish fishing was in this game. You get pirate vibes too? <laughs> yes. Oh my god, we got 200 likes. Thank you guys so much. Absolutely insane support. Yeah, this is definitely a pirate song, right? Can't wait for Roots Apache. Yes, I'll be doing lots of videos on that. I love that game. I've been holding off for a while, obviously, because I do have the alpha version of that game. So I can make videos and all that stuff, but... I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the release. Because there's going to be lots of new content that I can show off and... I don't want to burn myself out with that game. We love you, Sharky. I love you, Cass. I love you more. <laughs> right, yeah, it's, we need to expand this crafting room. I'm just going to get this stone up here. It's another good place to come and get some. You kickstarted it. Lovely. You're going to get that given to you then on release, right? We need to make rum. Yeah, we can do it soon. I think rum's actually in the game. Uh, let me just double check. As you can see, look at all this that we can make soon, guys. We just need to be level 12. I can't wait for this. So we can make whiskey, vodka, rum. Oh, my God. Gin. I can't wait to unlock this. That's going to give us so much money, right? We just need to get to level 12. We're nearly level 9, though. We're close. We're close. That's going to be exciting, though. That's going to be big money, money, money. Okay. And then get the seller to age it. Can you actually do that? Is there a seller in this game? I didn't even know that. That's insane if there is. Now, we are going to go down to see um, Bob and Nugget, the golem and the chicken. I want to see what they've got in stock for today. Turkey time! You damn thing! It's so fast. Aging shelves are a thing, I believe. Oh my god, is that actually a thing? See, this game still surprises me. Let's go into this little secret woods bit, because I think if I'm right, there is a coal place. Coal deposit. Let's have a look. So good to hear from you again, Sharky. Vent, thank you so much for joining the stream. It's so good to hear from you as well. So we actually have someone turn up here, don't we? Oh, guys, when does he appear again? What, what time and day is it that he comes? Because doesn't he sell, like, rare goods or something? Or was that just for the, um... The update. I don't know. When does he come? I forgot. Was it on Wednesdays or Thursdays or something like that? He sells parrot eggs. Yeah, I've totally forgot about this guy. Yeah, because we can have a parrot, right? We can train them. Oh, I totally forgot about that. We can have a talking parrot in the tavern. And don't they, like, help with the customers or something? They can kind of, like, make them a bit more happier and friendlier. And then you get more money. Thursday and a Sunday, hey, I think you might be right. That rings a bell. What day? It's Sunday right now. We should check. We should check. I think you can train them to, to, to do something with the customers. I think it helps out the tavern a little bit. I can't really remember. It was part of the update and I never really explored it, so... It just came to my mind then when I was in that forest. I really wish there was rain in this game. Some cozy rain. 
We need weather, right? I know seasons will be coming, so weather's got to come as well. Bob, oh, Bob, I love you. You are the best thing ever. Oh, just firewood and eggs today, nothing else. Okay, that sucks. But oh well, we can actually get this stone. It's almost eight as well. Yeah, we can go ahead and do that. I completely forgot about it. We'll stop by and have a look. As we get back there, we should be able to. Is there anything else this way? Yep, another little rock. We're getting lots of stone. This is amazing. Have you checked out Vampire Rancher, says Susie? I've never heard of it. Is it on Steam? If so, I'll have a little look. I'm not a massive fan of vampire things, but I'll have a look. I'll see what it's like. I don't mind, like, fantasy things, but when it becomes, like, supernatural, it's not really my cup of tea. I love medieval, prehistoric times, um, but I'm not huge on the old vampire werewolf thing. Let's go and have a look. I forgot his name as well. What's his name? Does it begin with an R? He's not here. I don't know how this works. Maybe it's not Sunday. Uh, it's not out yet. Got a cute vibe. Okay. Been following the development. Looks good. I'll have to check it out. Guys, I don't know when this guy comes here. Uh, maybe it's not Sunday. After 8. Should we check after nine, see if he comes? I do remember something briefly of this. I can remember checking it out one time, but then I just completely forgot about this guy who turns up. He's like a mystery trader, right? Yeah, he's not here. It must be a different day. I think, it, I think Wednesday rings a bell. I'll have to have a look. We'll come and check another time. Right, so, we've got plenty of stone, we've got enough planks, let's actually expand the crafting room so I can make some new tanks and ferment fermentation barrels so we can make more beer and more wine. You've just looked, Wednesday and Thursdays after 7, ah, I knew Wednesday rang a bell. Okay, well, that's good to know. Okay, let's see what we can do here, guys. So, uh, wood, we've got a little bit of wood left so I can turn those into some planks, perfect. Um, we've got this stuff here as well, the mortar, which we need big time, and the stone blocks, of course, but let's get more of this. Yes, we're going to expand. I'll probably sleep and do it in the morning. This is going to be exciting. Shall we also get some more nails on the go? Oh, yes, we've got some more coal today. That's good, good, good. Let's get them nails. Now, all this crafting reminds me of Graveyard Keeper. It's very similar. Okay, yeah, let's sleep this one off, and then we'll get all that stuff in the morning and see how much we can expand. We've got 10 gold to our name. Um, I guess we could start doing the... No, no, we'll do that. We'll do that tomorrow. Cat, just please, give me this. Just get up a bit more. Please. Right, we need to start making some more of this. I've got one piece of chocolate left, so let's make that Christmas log. I'm glad they're still in the game because they do make good money. Have we got anything else that needs to put away? We need to sell them. Strawbs. We gathered some more strawberries, didn't we? Here we go. We've got 80 strawberries. <coughs> Excuse me. I think those apples are in the other one. They are indeed. And we've got 14 turkey. We are absolutely... We're looking good. We're looking good. Right, let's get something on. Um, right, we've got no mead. Right, I think, first of all, let's see. We need to make some amber. We need some grapes. I keep forgetting about the grapes, man. I'm going to order some so they can come tomorrow. Oh, no, we planted some. Yeah, they should be growing soon. They should be growing soon. We should be okay. Right, let's see... What's trending? Shall we take a look what's trending, guys? Let's have a look here. Uh, we need to go to the calendar. Let's see what's popping off. Here we go. 
Here we go. So spicy things, chilies, leeks, and rye. Sweet pie, pickle. Right, the beers. IPA, porter, and rye ale. Right, let's make some IPA. And maybe some spicy pickle. And then some roasted chicken with leek, maybe. Can kind of have them together. And then we'll do some sweet pie. Right, okay. Let's have a look. We'll have to do that in the morning, though. So right now, we want some IPA. Oh, we can't do IPA. What was the other one? Porter and rye ale. Okay. We'll make some porter. Let's put some strawberry in there. We've got plenty of them. Let's put some um, dual hops in there. Strawberry and... What goes with strawberry? Lemon and strawberry? I don't know. Let's just do that. All right, come on, cat. Go to bed. Sharky is popping off on YouTube. I wish. <laughs> Are you keeping the cat's water bowl filled? Yeah, it's filled, look. It's got water in it right there. The only thing is, I don't think it's drinking it, guys. I don't know if this is in the way. It just doesn't seem to be drinking the water, look. I've not filled it for days. Oh my god, look at the heart. There's something not right. There's something not right. Why is the cat losing hearts? I don't get this game. I don't know if the water was glitched because it weren't drinking it, and that's the only thing I can think of. All the effort's gone, yeah, I've been trying my best. And look at that, I've woke up in the morning and it's gone. What does it want me to do? I'm never going to get that achievement. <laughs> never. Right, guys, I think it's time to expand the crafting room. Let's go out and see if we can uh, do something here. Right, let's... So first of all, the chocolate logs. We've got 75 of those. Oh my god, I need to stop making them. <laughs> There's so much. The sweet pie is actually trending, and we've already got some, which is good. We need to make so much stuff. Right, the porter's done. I'm going to pull this, so I don't forget. He'll love you eventually. <laughs> I don't think he ever will. Yeah, the door is the cellar, but... I'm pretty sure we couldn't unlock it yet. Yeah, there we go. Level 10. Can't wait for that. So is that where you age things? Oh my god, of course. I can't wait. We're so close to level 10 as well. We're nearly level 9 already. Uh, there we go. Okay, so there's... That's all pulled. We've got one keg. We've got one... Keg in this one. Uh, open. So five empty kegs. That's good. Let's put that in there. All that. Oh no, it's, yeah, it's there. There we go. So it's just gonna be grinding now. I, I think what I want to do is fill this out completely with stuff before I open the tavern again. I'm just gonna completely work on getting as much beer, drinks, food as possible. So then I don't have to worry about it for a while. I can just keep, you know, open the tavern, get loads of money. That's what I'm going to work on. This damn cat, I'm going to boot it in the face. <laughs> uh, someone suggested putting his bed near the fireplace. <gasps> Cats like the warmth. And it went up like crazy. Peggy, you're a superstar. Oh, there's no room by the fire, though. Is that actually a thing? Hold on. Have I been doing this wrong all that time? This damn cat is so needy, it's ridiculous. Right, what we can do... What we can do... Is... Where shall I put this? At the entrance as they come in? Whatever. Right, it's gonna go there. Look, that's, that's close to the fire. Right? When do we put that on? I swear down, if he doesn't like that... I'm getting rid of him. 
Need a second kitchen and a tank and then uh, keep that full. Yeah, exactly. We're going to work on it so hard. Oh, look, cat. Stay by the fire. Maybe we just need the fire. Why, why is he going upstairs? You don't belong up here, cat. This is for the guests. Honestly, that cat has given me so much stress. There's a reason I don't like them in real life. Right, let's expand this crafting room so we can start working on the production here. We need to expand a little bit more because we need that money. And I'm running low on beer and wine, so... Right, guys, let's see what we can do. More, so we can only make two more of that and then that's all we've got. So we've got five, we'll have seven pieces of mortar. We've got lots of nails. Is there anything else? Can we make any more? No, the planks is done. That's all we can do. Oh, I can get the stone for today. The girlfriend, the girlfriend has entered the chat. Hello, darling. Restock their fireplace fuel. Yeah, I do need to put some coal in there, to be honest. It's not a bad shout. Right, stone, those, we need those. Oh, we've got four mortar in there as well. Nice. I thought we had, had more than that. I was about to go crazy. Oh, I've got 55 planks on me as well. Let's go. There it is. There it is. Right, so that's left us with all of that. Okay, well, let's see what we can craft, guys. Let's see what we can expand, actually. That's what we're doing. So put those in there, put those in there. And that's what we've got to our name. So let's go. We're going to go to building. We're not going upstairs. We're going to the main floor. And obviously, we can go to the cellar eventually as well. Right, crafting room. Are you ready? Oh my god, already that's cost four gold. <laughs> that's all we can do. That's literally all we can do. Because we've only got two gold to our name. I could make both of these rooms go straight through. But kind of like the bedroom on its own. Okay, we've expanded it a little bit there. I could go one, two there as well. Uh, actually. Let's get that back. Kind of like that. That's all we've got. We can't afford anymore. We've got the resources. Look, 11 mortar. We've got the nails and planks. But we just haven't got the gold. Right, well, I'm going to accept that. We can at least get another two or three barrels in there. That's going to really help us a lot. I'm happy with that, to be honest, guys. I'm happy with that. Uh, oh, I've got that glitchy game where you can't open your inventory. It's done that a few times. Yeah, I can't open it. I don't know why it does that. Okay, so here we go. That's not looking too bad. Oh, we need to do the area as well, of course. We need to actually... Oh, Yeah, we should have enough for that. I always forget to do this. You want this game on Switch? Well, you better work for it then, aren't you? <laughs> it's not on Switch yet. It's coming soon. I don't think it will be um, on Switch until next year, if I'm honest. Still early access on um, PC, so... Right, let's go to zones. We're going to go with the crafting zone, and we can now... Ba -ba 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 -bum, expand this a little bit, guys. Look at that. Now, this actually also... No, it doesn't cost any materials. It's just you need to actually unlock them from your reputation. Um, eventually we're going to have this one and then these two. When we get two more gold, we'll knock that through and then we'll have one big room there. That's awesome. Yes, okay, that's looking good. Now let's go and try and craft some of the, the barrels that we need. So this is the first thing we need to work on, is the brewing barrel. Uh, look how much planks we need. All of those nails and planks that we've just worked so hard for, we're going to have to use again. Have we got any left? Oh, okay, we do. Iron sheets. 
iron sheets, you say? I can make some more of them anyway. And there's the nails. We need lots of them again. Right, so we can just go and get the iron sheets that we've got. We've only got five. Hmm. We need ten! Ten for one barrel! <laughs> My god! Well, we'll have to wait for all of those to produce and then we're done. And then what do we need? We also need... I think it was... This. Fermentation tank. We need 40 stone blocks. I'm going to make some more of those because we're going to need a lot of that. Uh, more iron bars and mortar. We can do that. Yeah, we can do that. So let's take out that mortar. Stone blocks and the planks. Because we're not expanding for a while, so... Just wait for the... Oh, we need the iron bars. We've got 49 of them. Plenty! So we can actually make the fermentation tank now. Oh, what? Oh, okay, sorry. I, f I, was, I thought that was level then. Let's get rid of those and then boom. It was the queue. <laughs> I was like, we've already got five? No, we haven't. We've only got one. Anvil. Forging. Have we got a forging tank? Oh, yeah, it's there, right? So what does that forging tank do? What does that do, guys? I think we've got one here, but you can't do anything with it. Does it improve the speed or something? Does anyone know what that does? You can't wait to see Crowley. That's his name. I forgot his name. Knight coming through with the name. So he's going to arrive on Wednesday, right? At about 7pm. So we'll go and check him out. Jumping in while I'm at work to say hi. Can't wait to get this game, says Flame. <laughs> Well, don't get caught. You get into trouble. But yeah, this game's great. Too bad the loans don't exist. I know, right? Potato! Improve the anvil speed. Is that what it does? Oh, we need to fuel it. Bloody hell. This thing. Right, hold on. We've actually got a lot of this forestry waste here, right? Let's take this out. I'm just going to fuel the hell out of this anvil. <laughs> Oh, hold on. The iron sheets are done. Yes, the brewing barrel. Let's go. We're going to have two of those. Right, fuel. I'm just going to spam this. Is this game for free? It's not free, no. You have to pay for it on Steam. Early access. But if I may recommend max your crafting yield before making your new barrels uh, and fertilize since you get two per... Oh! Damn. I don't think we can actually do that anyway. Uh, oh, the inventory's working. Yes. Um, yeah. So the crafting, we need 300 XP. And we've only got 228, so we can't do that just yet anyway. But I will do that. Sean, definitely. As soon as we get the 300 XP, I'm going to put it straight onto crafting. Farming and bartering, uh, bartending can wait. We definitely need to create more things. Crafting is going to be important. Right, I'll put all that on there, and then maybe let's fuel this up as well. Worth every penny. Yes, yeah, I think it's a good price, to be honest. For the content that we've got. Better than Stardew. It's a completely different game, though, isn't it, really? It's not a farming RPG like Stardew Valley is. Stardew Valley is heavily focused around farming and socialising. Uh, this game's completely different. It's all about managing a, a tavern. You know, customers, uh, producing things, making money, renovating. It's, it's, it's different. Different. Uh, it's similar, but it's different. Different genre. So it's hard to tell. Crafting and Agling are the best. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, it's similar in aspects. Like Lab said, but it is, it's a different game, right? So it's hot. You can't really say I prefer this over Stardew because it's not the same game. Right, we're just waiting for that. Come on. 
could get another blocks uh, a stockpile to be honest so we can make even more blocks that's not a bad idea and we could put that up here I think I'm gonna do that that's gonna be a good investment if I'm honest and then we'll do more stone all right so let's let's take a look uh, what else can we actually so there's the other grinder we're actually gonna need another one of those as well actually do we I don't think we do it's no it's more kegs and barrels that we need the most they're taking a lot of time though so what we can do is go out and gather some resources while waiting on that um, let's check the orders today what have we got that we need to do we need to make two of these now the the DIPA so we need one that's got fruit in it and one that's sweet but this is the thing, I don't really want to be making them for the orders anymore. I could do one for the XP. Just so we can level up that crafting. Let's have a look. So we need one that... Did it say fruit? We'll do the honey because I know there's a sweet one. That's going to be for the XP, and then we should be able to improve the crafting speed. Look at the space we've got in here now. Ho -ho! You know what we could do, guys? If we can try and earn two gold, I can knock this wall down. Oh my god, the cat's losing more hearts, guys. I swear down, this is crazy. What is going on? Oh, we need water. Crap. I hate this cat so much. I'm not even joking. Oh, the fire's gone. This goddamn cat is the the pain of my life. Let's get the water. I might open the tavern. I might get two gold. We've got a little bit of resource, well, products, beer and wine and stuff and food that we could sell. If we're just open for a few hours, we might be able to do it. Let's have a look. Let's try and get two gold so I can expand a little bit more. Yeah, we've still got some stuff, look. It's not a lot, but it might do. I know you don't need fire in the day. I'm trying to make the cat happy. I'm wondering if the cat wants the fire on. It's too warm. Is that what that noise was? Oh, the rooms! Yes, they're clean. Yes, we've got both the rooms in, guys. Let's do some haggling. Let's try and get some more money out of this. Oh, this is hard, though. There's one. Two. Come on, make it free to row. Shock. Hey, let's go. <laughs> let's go. I just want two gold. We've already got one. We've already got one gold already. This is insane. Come on. Give me that money. The cat's there. Just love me already. I'll fill his water up so he don't lose any more. I don't know what to do. I've put the bed near the fire. I can't put the fire on just yet, though, because it's not night time. So that's the only thing I can think of is the cat's getting cold at night because I, I, I always turn the fire off. Water the cat. <laughs> Water the bowl. Yeah, we've got a two gold, guys. We've got a two gold. That's all I wanted, really. And look, actually, let's get to level nine. We should be able to get to level nine reputation if we just finish this night off. This bloody cat, man, though. Like, it's going lower and lower. I don't understand it. The water's in a bad spot. Where do I put it, though? Should I put it, like, down, down here, maybe? Maybe it shouldn't be up here. Well, we can't actually get it yet. I don't know what to do with this damn cat. If I'm honest, guys, I just want to get rid of it. <laughs> I don't even want it. 
the water's not being used, it's in a bad spot. It's supposed to be emptied each day. Yeah, to be honest, I think something happened because the water was there for like four days in a row. Um, and I kind of moved the candle out of the way and then he started drinking again. So I think I glitched out the bowl and he wasn't drinking and I lost so many hearts with him. Well, heart points. So that was, that was bad and I didn't realize. The cat. <laughs> what the hell is this? A new milestone? An important guest is coming to visit? While an important guest is visiting, your reputation changes will be significantly increased. Oh my god! We get special guests? Right, hold on. Customer events. Look in the calendar, check it out. A maximum of two floor tile. Okay, so we can now have two more people come. In. We can make two more rooms, basically. Two more guest rooms. We can have more floor and the dining tiles and the crafting one as well. Or oh, one extra room. Okay. Can you put two beds in one room? So you can have like two per one? I don't know. Right, to be honest, I don't really want to open that long. I just wanted my two gold, so I'll put last orders in. I don't really want to be open all night long. I just want to expand that crafting room by those two blocks. Because it was kind of doing me head in. So let, let all these go. We've got to level 9 now as well. Perfectly what we wanted to do today. Um, yeah, still got a bit of stuff. Right, I'm going to put the fire on. And let's see what the cat does. What are you doing up here? Right. So let's move this bowl. Let's move it down a little bit more. It seems to hang out here quite a lot. Let's put it... Will, it, will he drink it there? Yeah, surely, right? We'll see. We'll keep our eye on that. I don't know. I don't know. We still need that bench for this table. Oops. Right, cat. You're staying out here all the time. You're never coming upstairs, okay? You're staying down. You've got your bed there, you've got the heating on, and you've got the water bowl. There's no reason for you to not be happy. There's the bench. We've actually got it on us. <laughs> nice. I forgot about that. Uh, oh, what the hell? This needs to be lower. But then I don't think people can sit there. That bench is not going to get used. Oh! Hmm. We can't actually have two there. Can we have them go in the other way? Like that? Yeah, this, this is going to work. This is going to work. Got it. There it is. Um, are you going to be... Yeah, you can go there as well. Where's the other bench? There it is. Let's see if that works. Where's the cat? Oh, you keep going up there? Ooh. I want to see his heart. Yeah, it's rubbish. Absolute rubbish. Okay, let's go and expand. We've got free gold now. That's perfectly enough. Um, I'm hoping we've actually got enough. What's going on? Why is that not working? What's going on with that? We've got the fuel in there. That's been not working for a while, so I think that's glitched out. Is that working? Yeah, there we go. That was glitched. I wonder what was going on. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, the brewing barrel's done. Let's go. So, um, let's go to building. Let's knock down these two. Boom, boom. Oh, enough planks? <laughs> no! Please don't do this. We should have some planks, right? 
29? 13? Why is... Oh, you have to put it into there. Not on your inventory. So you've got to put your resources in here like that. If you want to build. Wow, those nails. Uh, we've, we've lost a lot of them nails. We really don't have much, do we? Right, now we should be able to do it. Let's go. Let's knock down these two. One. What? Nails? Where are all the nails? Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> I didn't put them in here. <laughs> That's not going to be enough anyway. I think it's five for one floor. So let's get this one. There we go. That should be enough now. Whew. Right now, please let me do it. So it's five planks, five nails for one floor with the one gold. Yes, there we go. And there it is, guys. We've got the full crafting room done. We've now got our barrel and our keg. Well, fermentation barrel and the tank. Barrel and the tank. That's going to be good to actually produce more beer and wine now at a time. Also, we've got our stone stockpile. So we can make more planks. Lovely! So as you can see, we only require one stone to get three stone blocks. Whereas before, it used to be two stone, three stone blocks. So our stone's going a long way now. That's what I really like about it. The stone that we gather is actually giving us a lot in return. The zone! The, z <laughs> the zone! <laughs> oh, I always forget about the zone. It should automatically do it. Crafting zone. There we go. Yeah, that would have been so annoying. <laughs> okay, that's perfect. Look at that big room. Oh, I love it. Have we got the two guests? They're still in the, the, the rooms, right? Yeah, they don't make it easy at all. Do not forget about the zone. <laughs> I already did. Can we actually see the two people in the room if we go in there? Oh, they blacked out. It's locked. So yeah, both of them are filled. Privacy. Who knows what they're up to in there, guys? Right, the water bowl, keep an eye on it. If that doesn't get empty in the morning or tomorrow, we know the cat's not drinking it. Which means we need to move it. Hold on, where is, where is the goddamn cat? I bet he's upstairs again. What? How is the cat here? Does it go through doors? Absolutely, this is insane. This cat, hold on, does it go through the doors? He snuck through, hasn't he? He snuck through. I hate him so much. Right, let's put those two here. Look at it. Look at it. The space now is insane. I'm loving it. You know what? Uh, no, I can't put that there, can we? Right, let's have a look a second. Maybe I can... Oh, it's crafting right now, of course. Let's put that there. Let's gather that. Boom, boom. Yes, and we can kind of have them going all the way up. <laughs> and you can... No, you can't run between them. Oh, no. That's not good. It's going to have to be like that. So I can actually get through there and do it. All right. That's, that's all right. It'll do me. Uh, chest. We're going to put those at the bottom here. And then we can now have that... There. For now. Let's go! What do we need? Do we need fuel in here as well? Oh, look at the coal. We're going to need a lot more of this. Oh, my God. So, look. We can now start making more of this stuff, which is good. We'll put a dark one on there. Things that we're running low on. The, we need the IPA one. Because you need that in order to make this. But we can make some mead. We're just going to put a bit of all sorts in there. Uh, 
Yeah, let's do a strawberry and a lemon again. Wheat log, we've never made any of that, but now look, we can start making our red wine. We need to be doing this big time. Let's make it fruity. And sour. There we go, fruity and sweet. But look, we can make two at a time. This is good. I need my grapes to be done. It's taking so long. All right, let's get grinding on this food as well. Uh, let's make some soup. You can't go wrong with some soup. Let's go with tomato. I love a tomato soup. With a bit of basil in there. Have we got any basil? I don't have any basil. Sucks. Put some green beans and courgette. Let's put some chili in there. Oh, I love that. We need some milk. Make it creamy. Uh, and then we'll just go with... Why not? Let's put some onion in there. Some nice, aromatic, sweet, spicy tomato soup. One of my faves. Right. Was this for the quest? I think it were. I love the way you say basil. <laughs> what do you guys say? You don't say basil. Is it... You guys say basil, don't you? Basil! Right, look, 80 XP. Now let's see if that's going to be enough for our... Oh my god, it is, guys, the crafting. We're going to get an 150% yield. Come on! We're making moves in this game right now. Gonna get some more of these on the go soon as well. Another oven would be good as well. Making double food. I think that's what we should work on next. Uh, iron bars, iron sheets, and stone blocks. Iron bar, iron sheets, and stone blocks. And we've got no iron sheets. Of course we've got no iron sheets. Do we ever have what we want? So, definitely going to create another oven. I think that's going to be so important. Just need them 20, uh, 20, 20, 20 iron sheets. At least we're getting two every time. That's not bad. It's better than one. It used to be one. Kind of wait for that a little bit. In the US, uh, basil is is a person, and basil is the herb. No reason for the water bowl. <laughs> What's happened with the bowl? <laughs> He's not drinking it. <laughs> Oh, look, it's sleeping near the fire, though. I just don't know. I don't really understand what's going on with him. It's just a liability, this cat. How about if we come over this way a bit more like this? This makes more sense. And then have him, like, directly in front of the fire so he can burn to death. <laughs> I don't know about the water bowl, actually. I think that might be a good place. Hoping so, anyway. They don't seem to be drinking it. Honestly, at one point, we had nearly a full heart, and I was so hopeful. I was like, yes. Why do you keep wondering up here, cat? Like, why... Look, he's going lower. I hate him with a passion. You're so annoying. You just don't make it easy for us at all. I wish you could kick in this game. 
Right, okay, let's... Uh, I, uh, yeah, we're going to pass out and sleep down. Put water bowl in the lower right corner of the pub so there is room all around. You know what? Yeah, we have got some space there for now, haven't we? Right, let's see if the water's gone at this point. What was that noise? No. Oh, the... Look, he's sleeping in front of the fire. Oh, it's going up. It likes the fire. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> I burnt him. Yeah, so let's just put this in this corner here. Because look, we can't use that room. Is he going to go there, though? I just want him to drink the damn thing. So now you're back up here. I wish we could put doors on these rooms. You're wandering everywhere. Right, okay, Lord, we're making some stuff now. Look at this go, man. Let's go. We need some of this one. Ooh, we need, we need water. We're all out of water. Some champagne. Let's make some red wine, guys. You know what I'm going to do? We're going to do a water... I've not used watermelon in a, in a while. Let's do some... And juniper berry. Why not? Uh, this is going to be bitter and sour. <laughs> this is wine you don't want to drink. <laughs> Stay away from this wine. It's going to burn your nostrils. Let's get some more stuff on the go. Uh, let's go with some stew. We're going to go with some uh, beef. Uh, thyme. And maybe uh, potato. Okay, that's fine with me. Yeah, we need water. We need water. We need some water. I wonder if my red grapes are done too. Oh, the cat's looking a bit more... A bit more uh, happier recently. The parrot can babysit the cat. What day is it? Do we forget about the... Oh, Tuesday, it's tomorrow. Oh my god, yes. The problem is, it's going to cost a lot of money. Oh, the grapes are done. Yes, we can make more wine. Why is the items not gathering? They do take so long. That's another thing I wish to change is sometimes the items that you know, drop on the floor. They take so long to come towards you. <laughs> we need a magnet that can just, like, make them come to us so much faster. Yeah, we've got some stuff here. Right, the iron sheets are done. What was we doing again? I was making the oven, right? Yeah, we still need more iron sheets. Of course we do. Of course we do. We can't craft anything right. We need more wood as well. Are the trees growing at this point? Because we, we we need the <laughs> we need the wood. I think they're coming along well. Right, let's get the bucket of water. We definitely need this stuff. Da -da -da -da. I'm not gonna do any of these orders for a while. Because we need the actual products ourselves. We need all of the, the beer. Oh, we need the wine. Yeah, we need this stuff ourselves. How many streams until the cat likes you? Probably a million at this point. I just don't think it's going to happen, guys. <laughs> he, he, like, teases us. We get so close. And then all of a sudden, he just goes down to, like, zero. That's it, we're stocking up a bit. We've got some soup in there now. Let's go! I mean, every time I see him, look, I'm going to pet him. I mean, so far, so good. He's not he's not hating us. Right, pickle. Oh, was that still trending? I don't know. We're going to do it. We're going to put some in there, though. Let's do some pickled onion that's spicy. Why not? Put like, garlic in there and all. I'm just creating everything at this point. We just need to get get producing. We need to keep busy. Uh, let's get something else. Let's get some of this white wine on the go as well. And we can put some raspberry. 
Let's just have that on its own. Why not? Let's see what's trending though. Oh look, tomorrow is the special day where we've got a guest coming. <gasps> I'm scared. I'm nervous. Brown ale. So strawberry is good to put into things at the moment. It's quite popular. Uh, so if we're making any beer, brown ale, pilsner, and wheat lager, we need to be putting strawberries in there. And stew. Stew and soup is popular. And guess what? We're making some of that stuff. Let's go. Stew again. Let's do some pork, cabbage, <laughs> and green beans. <laughs> we're just doing all sorts right now. The thing is with this game at the moment, the actual things you put into there doesn't really benefit anything. Uh, you can literally put whatever you want in there, and it doesn't change the way the stew or the porridge or whatever is, uh, other than it making it like sweet and sour, which is for quests and orders. Doesn't really matter to the customers. You can literally put whatever you want in there. Why are you not drinking your water? It's right there. More stew. There's the red wine. Oh, yes. We're filling this out. There's the pickle. This is what I wanted, guys. I just wanted to keep making stuff. Red grapes can go in there. Does anything else need to be in there? It's in the other one. Here we go. Let's also do... The soup was a popular one as well, right? Um, so let's do a meaty stew this time. Uh, soup. Do like a chicken one. So... The strawberry was popular. I forgot what other ones were. That'll do. Always get them raisins. So we can make the red wine. Do some of that. This is a lot better now that we've got all this going on. I feel like the crafting speed is better as well. I feel like these are producing a bit faster. Is that actually what that skill does? Yeah, it is. Look at that. The crafting speed. So I feel like we're making these beer and wines so much faster now. It's really helping. That's like one of the best skills you need to be going for. Right, let's uh, go and put away the... Oh, I've got some stew that needs to go away. Did people leave the rooms? I think they did. I don't like that cat bed there because it gets in the way. I can't actually walk through there. The only way to do that is... No, you can't even do that. Hmm. Try that. I took that away nicely in the corner, and then we can come across with this one more. That might be able to make me walk through there now. Yeah, let's try that. So look, I can actually come through and cut through there now. That's good. That's good, good, good. Uh, okay, one left. Right, come on, get out of this room. Thank you. Look at the X. Oh my god, that was amazing. We're gonna clean these rooms. I actually had something that I wanted to put. We had this small bronze eye. I don't really know what it is, but it, it adds 10 comfort. So I'm gonna put that into this room here. Can we not? Oh, it's a standing thing. Oh. That's, isn't that strange? That's such a weird thing. Oh, you can put it on the shelf. You can put it on the shelf. Let's go. Oh, that was cool. All right. So now this room's got 66 comfort, which means we'll get more money and reputation when someone comes through. Make the bed. Clean up. Can we fix the cockeye table? <laughs> which which one? <laughs> I'll have a look. Is one table being a bit weird? Right, that one's done. This candle's still burning in there as well, so the customer will be happy. 
This one needs a bit more comfort. This one's... I feel like this room's the best. We've made it look good, but it's only 52 comfort, so... What else do we need to put in there? Maybe something above the wardrobe, maybe a window. The window might let some light in, that might be good. We even put a teddy on the bed, come on! This room should be perfect. Right, okay, the rooms are good. They're ready for the next two people. Uh, what's the cockeyed table? This one. At the bottom. <laughs> We've got this rug here. Maybe I can put that like, like that. What do you guys think? I, I just kind of want the cat to be in front of the fire because I don't know if that's actually helping or not. It's going, to the, it's going to the water. Come on. Yes. Go, putty cat. Go on, give us the heart. He does drink it here. This is good. Oh, he has a big drink. A suit of armor. That would be nice in there. <gasps> okay. All right, all right. We'll fill that back up. I think we're getting there. It does take a long time though, doesn't it? Ooh. Alrighty then. Um, I just need to be making all this stuff. I don't know, really know what it is. But I'm just going to keep stocking up on it. As much as we can, guys. Uh, let's go with... Um, more of this stew and soup because it's popping. Look how much we've got. <laughs> My god. That is crazy, isn't it? Let's maybe do the chocolate for now because I can finish the rest of the Christmas Yule logs. Okay. The cat's being our friend. Which is good. I don't... No, I'm not going to bother with the, uh, those orders yet. Let's make all the stuff for our tavern rather than the orders. I think we're in a good place at the minute where we don't need that much XP. We're doing okay. Uh, right, there's the iron sheets. So now I need the other oven. So we can cook two things at a time. Two big meals. Uh, we still need more iron sheets. How much have we got? 18. Oh my god. That is crazy. Right, we just need those two. Oh, we're running low on coal. We are running low on coal. This is not good. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I've been forgetting to get all this coal every day, you know. Now leave the bowl alone. Yeah, it's staying right there. <laughs> We've got a girl, so happy I caught one of your streams finally, Sharky. Have a good day and night, everyone. You too, Tasha. Thank you for tuning into the stream. I hope you enjoyed it and had a cosy time. And uh, I'll see you on another one, hopefully. Did they add a huge update or something? Because as far as I can remember from the game, it's like I'm stuck inside around the tavern only. Or they changed that. Frost, you can go different places now. You can go north, south. There is a few areas that are slowly opening the game up so you can explore more. You are not just stuck on this one area. I recommend diving in and checking it out. Uh, there definitely is a few more places you can go. And the newest update, there's a brand new area, almost like a farm. Um, there's a farmer who lives there with his family. There's a new stone golem who sells rare items. Well, not rare, but random stuff. Is it Thursday today? What day are we on? Wednesday? Because we need to go and see that Crowley. Oh, it's tomorrow. Okay. The one thing you want to start early, the wood stockpile. Yeah, the wood and the stone stockpiles. Uh, they give you so much uh, production. So you make more planks and more stone every time. Okay, so... Oh, those iron sheets. I just want this oven. That's literally, it takes so long to get one thing in this game. 
but we love it. It's grindy. Iron bars. <laughs> now we need the iron bars because we was using them for the iron sheets. Oh my god, it takes so long. This is wild. Right, don't use the iron bars. We need them. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Let's get this coal and stone. Set the cat bed and water bowl next to the fire mainly so you can watch the water who drinks more than one a day. Okay. So keep it similar to the fire. It just gets in the way of the tables though. But then you can't really have as many tables and chairs in there. John, glad to have caught an actual stream. I appreciate being here, John. It's good to see you join a stream. I know the time zones are a little bit crazy, right? So, let me. So, does the, the cat drink the water more than once a day? Well, right now it's still there. I didn't really want to. I mean, I, I, we know he drinks it there, though. But look, we've not got much space. What about if I put it like on the rug in the middle? <laughs> At least it's close and it's in the center so we can always see if it's empty or not. And every night we need to put the fire on because I think the cold was really getting to it. So, yeah, we should be good. Let's give you another pet. Oh, is that going down again? I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to tell. He has a habit of doing this. So what are we needing now? We need ale yeast. We can make some lager. Wheat lager was popular, I think. I don't really know what to put into here, though. Kind of just going to put what? Oh, strawberries popular. We need to be putting strawberries in things, of course. So whatever we make, we can make some strawberries. Oh, champagne, you can't put anything in. It's just on its own, I guess. Right, the other oven is coming. The other oven. <laughs> the other oven is coming. Right, we can make some more of that Yule Log now that we've got the two chocolate. Let's go. I think what we'll do is um, we'll move that into the corner there. Can we put... Oh, look at that. That's cool. And then the other oven is going to go there. I like that. that they're cool. It's like a, a little cloth or towel when you're cleaning or cooking. That's where the other oven's going to go. So, let's go and see if the iron is done now. What time is it? We need to put the, the fire on soon. This is going to be the last day, though, guys, for the stream. As soon as this day's done, we've got to end it. I've been going for a long time, and I need some food. Oh, we're making two ovens now, because we've got the crafting bonus. Oh, my God, that's insane. We're going to be able to have three of these. Woo, let's go. Right, stone blocks, of course, always. Oh, the pirate songs come back in. So this is a bronze eye. This one, is this one on the wall, rather than that one standing up? We do need to be crafting things for the rooms to make the comfort go up a little bit more. Like, maybe like these, you know what I mean? These only use copper, and I'm not really using that in the game at the moment. So I'm going to create some of these, like... Nice shiny stuff for the rooms. Nails. Yeah, the wood. We've got no wood at all. Okay, so let's have a look here. There's the stone blocks. This is the things to upgrade. The tavern. Let's take all of that out for now. Since we're not upgrading. This decorative sword looks awesome. I think we need to craft that. I want some of those candle wall holders as well. And look, we're getting two of everything. Ooh, the bonus is kicking in. We're making some good stuff now, guys. I want this as well. The ornamental axe and shield, but 
We need a decorative shield for that, which we've... De oh, is that what? A decorative sword. This armor looks cool as well. So where's the decorative shield then? Is it this? I don't know. Okay, I think we're getting there. Uh, what else can we do? We're just waiting on the the ovens, right? I want those to yeah hurry up so we can put them into the tavern in the crafting room. All right, what do we need to put away in our inventory? Yeah, we've got quite a lot of stuff here. Got some wine, some soup, some uh, white wine as well. Let's go. Oh, these are nearly done. The oil lamps, I think they'll be good to put on the shelves. They might add some good comfort. Fire's going on, Catty. There we go. That's its name. I'm going to call it Catty. Right, let's have a look. We've got two, which is good. Look at that. Yeah, that's looking amazing. Comfort's going to go up to 55 in that room. Oh, we can actually have one there as well. Sneakily. Too much is going on there, so let's... Yeah, and then we'll move that a little bit that way. And then we'll rotate that one to make it a little bit different. There we go. So this comfort is 55 now. Not too bad. We need to get it a bit more, though. I, do, I will put candles in there. Before we open the tavern again. Because no one will move into the room until you've got light. And this one's 69. Okay, that's better. I think the window's doing this. That must give you a lot of comfort. Uh, on the wall next to the stool. What do you mean? One more day of Crowley. Oh yeah, we've got to go to Crowley, right, as well. You have a, a candle hold on the fireplace you aren't using. Yeah, like I said, if it's in those rooms, I only put candles in when you open the tavern. Otherwise, you don't need no light source. It's only when guests are here to make them happy. Otherwise, you're just going to waste your, your candles because they'll just burn out. So when I open the tavern and the rooms, I will definitely put candles in the holders. What do we need for this? A light malted barley. So that's all this thing up here, right? No. This stuff. That's what we need. Just make whatever we can then. Some eggnog without alcohol. Why not? Eggnog. Cat, look, I'm, I'm loving you every time you come by, so... Just hurry up already. Let's put the food away in the menu, ready for when we do open again. We're definitely stocking up now, so much better than we did. Look at that. We're getting a lot of stuff in here. Look at all the stew, all the different ones, different soups. Yeah, we get, we're getting there. We're getting there, guys. I wonder if they can go into the other one, actually. It's hard to tell which ones to go in, because we can't, like, automatically transfer them over, which is frustrating. But that'll do. I think we can put chocolate and the raisins in there. Then we're going to clear all of this stuff that we've got before we sleep. Oh, the decorative sword. All right. Put nails in there for now. The iron bars. I think the ovens are done. Oh, we've got to put those down. Put the stone away for now. Stone blocks. 
Uh, I've really, I'll put the mortar in there for now as well. Let's put the wooden planks away. We need to fill up the four buckets. We've only got one keg left. Might have to buy some more of those. Right, okay. So let's go and put these ovens down and then we can call this one a night. Uh, we've got the deck. Oh, yeah, we've got some stuff here to decorate as well. Let's see what else we can do in them rooms. To be honest, it might be nice to put something like this. Oh, look at that up there. That looks amazing. And then some candle holders next to it. Actually, I might get some torches instead. Yeah, we've got to also get the comfort up in this room. 190. When you put some candles in here, yeah, it's going to look good. Oh, the cat is sleeping by the fire. I think he likes it. I think he likes it. Yeah, we've actually got another one of these swords, but I don't think we can fit this anywhere. This is the thing. Um, the only thing is, can we lower the window? And then maybe have it like going above? Okay. That's not bad. That's 79 comfort in there. Holy smokes. Just putting things everywhere, guys. So we definitely need to put, I think, a candle holder up there would be nice. This incense burn on this table down here. This is 87 comfort. Oh my god. Hmm. So what if I move this a little bit this side? There we go. Oh, look at that. 93 comfort. We'll just change that dramatically. That's really good. Just filling out the rooms a little bit more. I think it looks so cool. You don't need to hire a staff for the special visitor. You want to be able to... Okay, yeah, so... Tomorrow's the big day, then. We've got a special guest coming. We're going to see Crowley. Um... Yeah, this is going to be interesting. Let's have a look at the calendar again. So there we go. A very important guest. Oh, God. Have we got enough stuff for this? Are we ready? Are we ready for a guest? Oh, God. This is going to be horrible. I feel stressed already. Let's get some more stuff in there. We need to find out what's trending, actually, if we're going to open tomorrow. Still the strawberries. Wheat lager... And brown ale with strawberries. We can't make anything. What the hell? Why can't we make anything? Oh, hold on, what's yeast? And we've got no kegs. Of course, we've got no kegs. We need to pull this beer. The rooms look excellent, said Time Duck. I appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, I've put some time and effort into them. They look good. I'm hoping the guests appreciate them. The bronze eyes are really good for comfort in rooms. Yeah, I've already got one in there. They helped a lot. So we've only got one keg to our name. Oh, no, we've got two now. Why can't we make anything? Like, we're running low on things here. There's the wheat lager, and we put the strawberry in it because that seems to be popular. What food was popular? What food was trending? Was there any food? I think it was just... Yeah, the stew and the soup. And we've got some roasted fish as well. A 
Okay, so let's just keep making the, the stew and stuff then. We can make a veggie stew on this one. Let's put in uh, carrots, a potato, and maybe leek in that stew. A vegetable one. Right, look. Oh, there's another keg. A keg full of wheat lager. Two! We made two. Oh my god. The crafting bonus is amazing. Let's pull all this beer before we sleep. And then we should be ready for tomorrow. Yeah, the cat's heart is definitely getting better. I think sleeping in front of the fire is helping. That was a great shout. Tie your napkin around your neck. <laughs> and we'll provide the rest. Busy day tomorrow. I don't know what the special guest is going to do. It's like a VIP guest or something, right? Yeah, we're getting tired. I know. We just need to pull this beer. Hey, look, the cat's sleeping in front of the fire. Okay, both of those are empty now. And then we can put all that in there. Bush. 40. Wheat lager. Nice. Oh, the ovens. I forgot about the ovens, guys. Oh, we'll do it in the morning, quickly. Right, the last busy day. The last busy day, guys. Oh, let's be having you. This is going to be crazy. Okay, let's go. Let's have this busy day. You think you're playing Traveler's Rest, but you're playing <laughs> Catherine. <laughs> We're playing Trying to Make the Cat Love Us Simulator. Right, let's not forget those two ovens this time. So. Let's put those up there. Right, there we go. Look at that. Let's go. Oh, we can't put another one there. No. Free ovens. We are cooking right now. We need a Michelin star. Oh, we've got a fuel. <laughs> we've got to fuel all of these. Oh, this is going to rinse us. The fuel is going to be a problem. Big time. But we're looking great, though. Everything needs fuel. Everything. Oh, God. We need coal or firewood. Big time. Otherwise, we're going to not be able to produce anything. How do you zoom out? So you go into the settings here. And there should be an option that says camera. Far, or you can have it near. Hope it helps. Right, guys, we've got a crazy day today. Crazy, crazy day. So let's open up the tavern first for the... Uh, oh, we've got some more wheat lager. Let's put all this away. We've got to get prepared. Luckily, we're stocked up now. We're doing okay. Uh, let's just put these two kegs in here. This is wild how much beer we're making now, though. Oh, my God. The cat owner simulator is so realistic. They never go where you want and always hold you to... <laughs> yeah, they are pain. Right, that's all that keg done. 
Let's do the next one, and then we should be good. I'm going to hire some staff, though. We need help, guys. I'm going to have one person who's going to be cleaning tables. And you know what? We could possibly hire another one who's going to serve customers. So we can just stand around and do nothing. Or is that just going to be too much money? That's going to be showboating. <laughs> We've got to impress this guest. Cat, I thought he was going to drink the water then. Come on, man. Oh, that heart is that's nearly full, guys. Why is he not drinking, though? <clears throat> you should be able to drink that. Have we got anybody in the rooms right now? No, we haven't, have we? Right, let's put... Oh, okay, this is amazing. Let's go. So, if we go to staff... Shall we get a bartender, guys? I know we're definitely going to need the... The floor worker. But shall we do a bartender as well? All free. Don't forget the candles. Yeah, before I open, I'm going to be doing that. So you think we should be getting the uh, the rented rooms as well? All right. Let's go and put the candles in. We also need candles inside the tavern as well. Oh, have we got enough candles for this? Oh, this is not good, is it? Right, we just need one in there. One in there. I think... Let's just see what we've got spare. Because they only need one source of light, right? Yeah, that's it. They don't actually require more than one candle. So, whereas these ones in here, they need the light. Uh, on the actual tables here. The fire should light up this centerpiece. So we should be alright with that. Oh, there's the staff. Look at them coming. We're professional around here. We're a proper business. Okay, this is, yeah, this is looking good. I'll put one in that far corner there. Uh, you know what? We'll put one on each table. We'll save two for the upstairs. I think that's good. We'll put one on the fireplace too, why not? And then let's go and put these ones into these holders up there just to create a little bit more light and it just looks better, right? And you know what? Shall we have put on the desk there? Let's do it. That room's already. We are ready. Shall we open? Shall we have an early start? We've got all the beer and the produce. Oh, look at the bartender. <laughs> we don't have to do anything. This is so good. The cat. Pet you. Oh, you're looking good. You're looking good. Let's open up. We've got a special guest coming, guys. Let's keep our eyes out for him. We can focus on the rowdy customers. That's all we need to do is just kick people out. This is incredible. Right, I don't know about this uh, special guest. We've got to look out for him. Yeah, when we see a special guest, if we do, we need to be speaking to them. I just don't know how they look like. He's kicking off already. You've just joined. What the hell? Maybe does the special guest have a special costume, or do they have something above their head to tell us, or do we have to kind of like guess who they are? We'll see. So far, though, we can just wait around. The cats love... Right, we don't need the, the fire on. It's not cold at all. We can fire the staff later. But for the VIP, we need full hands. Yep. All right. Yeah, we'll dismiss the workers afterwards. I heard the owner of this place is a cultist. What do you mean? Where are you getting this gossip from? Oh, God, this, this is so much better. Just watching the tavern do its thing. I love it. We literally just get to stand here and, and watch. All our hard work. We are running a business right now. Look, he's going to clean the tables. Where's the VIP guest though, guys? The, the cat is the special guest. 
Of course! All along, the VIP was the cat. Yeah, we'll put the fire on about six or seven. When it starts to get cold. This is interesting. This is lively. Where's the cat disappeared to? I was gonna shut that door and keep him in here, but he's gone. Okay, yeah, everything's getting worked on here. The tables are looking... Oh, this is amazing. I don't know who the VIP is. I hope we've had a good service, though. So far, no one's kicking off. We're doing all right. We turned it on earlier, fell asleep, and then woke up an hour later. It was still on. <laughs> Shark is still here. <laughs> Honestly, oh my god, how long have I been streaming? Like four hours? Oh crap. This is crazy. This is literally taking over my life. I can't stop. At this point, the food's gonna have to skip. I'm hungry, but I'm just not eating. I don't care. We need to see Crowley at seven o'clock as well. So I'm hoping we can sort the... Oh my god, this just looks amazing. Everyone's feasting. Yeah, when we sort the VIP out, we'll go and finish the, the rest of the day, but... The cat drank! <gasps> good spot, good spot, good spot. Uh, why can't I fill? Oh, we can. All right, fire doesn't need to go on yet. No one's kicking off. All right, let's give the cat a pet. The hot is so close. We are getting better. I want to see the VIP. Oh, the room! We have to still do this? Oh, that's my bad. That's my bad. I think we still have to put people into the rooms. Oh, there we go. We got someone kicking off. Calm down or get out. Hey. <laughs> yeah, so we still have to put people in rooms. All right. That's good to know. I forgot to haggle. Oh, no. I forgot to haggle. I keep forgetting about the haggle. Oh, I think there's, there's someone here. This is a... I think this is a room. All right, you ready, guys? We're going to haggle. Come on. Three in a row. Let's not mess up this time, Sharky. We've got this. Let's concentrate. Boom. There's one. Oh, this is a tough one. Oh, we got it. Come on. No. Oh, okay. Well, two out of three is not bad, I suppose. That was tough, that one. Okay, we've got two people in the rooms, though. That's all good. We have got uh, a staff who can go up there and and look after those rooms. The VIP will have a star above their head. Is that right? Oh, okay. I'm excited to see that. Oh, I hope, <laughs> I hope we don't mess up with the VIP. We've got good service, though. We're fast. Everything's getting looked after. I'm not going to be stressing out doing it myself, you know? Right, we don't need to fire on yet, either. Can't see no star VIP yet. Look how much money she got. Yeah, the pennies are going up. And you know what? It's only 3 p.m., guys. We could open till, like, midnight, and so much money's going to be rolling in. Okay, so far so good though. How long does the VIP take to come? Like, is he a certain time? Check food and drink stocks. I feel like we're doing good because we, we, I put a lot in there. Okay, yeah, the, <laughs> they've rinsed us. Oh my God, but it's okay. Look, we've still got a lot of wheat lager, a lot of red wine, so much chocolate Christmas logs. Look at all the stew in the soup because that's trending right now, obviously, so... Yeah, I think we're all right. I think we're doing good. Let's keep going. I'll stay by the fire because I'm going to turn it on when we need to. We don't want the VIP to complain that it's cold. That's for sure. Pet the cat. This cat just goes anywhere you want. Oh, God, I feel that heart's getting so close now. Two gold last time, look, we're almost almost seven. Oh my god, yeah, we're doing good. 
And you know what, the reputation's flying up as well. Now the money's not going to be going up as much as you would see if I was doing it. Because we are paying a lot of wages right now. We have got free staff and I think they all, we're charging them like what, 15 silver every hour? So, it's definitely not as much money as we should be making. But because it's a special day and the VIPs could come any time, we need to be all, uh, you know, professional, a bit more smoother. So I don't mind spending the money today, but I think we'll be making so much money if we didn't, we wasn't doing this. You may need to miss Crowley this time. Yeah, like when does the VIP come? We'll have to see. We'll have to see. If he comes any time now, we should be all right. I can close up, but... I love this sword on the wall at the back there. That's such a cool place to, to have a drink. We should have put a candle up there, but it's all right. Warm food and cold drink. The place has made my day. Ooh, someone's kicking off. What do you mean it's watered down? No, it's not. Calm down or get out. There we go. God, that was close. We don't want anyone to be kicking off on VIPs here. We're just... We're, we're like security. <laughs> That's my job role. I am the security. I just... I'm the, I'm the bouncer. I kick people out if they're kicking off. That's my job role now. And that was the VIP, imagine. <laughs> we kicked out the VIP. You better not be. I can't see no stars. No one's here, guys. This is crazy. Are you sure they come in today? I don't want to close until... I feel like we're going to be running out of stock. No, we should be alright for that. Fire's going on soon. No, see, they're saying it's way too hot. So you can't put it on until, I think it's 8 p.m. The lights have kicked in. Oh, no, we can put it on now. Lovely. What was that noise? Oh, God. <gasps> Calm down. Okay, I'll pipe down. Good, 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 good. Look at this tavern looking good. Stay around all midnight. Stay around until you run out on midnight. We've got to, I guess. Are you sure they, they come in today? Let's check the calendar. A very important guest is visiting. Yeah. Definitely today. The 17th, right? Craziness. So far, so good. You love the background chatter. It's old fashioned pub cozy vibes. Yeah, it really is. It's so cool. So cool. Guys, it's 9 p.m. nearly, and the VIP is not here. We have opened since like 10 o'clock this morning. Have we missed the VIP? Have we already served him? I actually have no idea. There's a bug with the VIP. No, you're joking. Oh, we're not going to be able to experience it. Oh, that sucks. So they just don't show? If you go to sleep after midnight the night before, it bugs out. 
And I always go to sleep at midnight. <laughs> no. Oh, that sucks. They didn't fix that bug? Oh, I wish I knew about that. All that for nothing. Is that actually true, guys? Because I'll close right now and we can go and see Crowley. Oh, right. We'll have to close up. Because that's if that, that bug is still there, then it's just pointless, right? Is Crowley still going to be there at 10pm, guys? Your rep gains double when they're here. So have we missed out on that rep gain as well? Or do we still get the rep gain, but they just weren't here? I quickly want to pop in to, to see Crowley, guys. I want to see if he's here. Uh, we need to also send these home or we'll be charging money still. I can't believe we missed out on the... The, uh, the event there. That's annoying. I wish I knew about that bug. If I knew you had to sleep before 12 p.m. to do it, I would have done it. But best thing is, we made a lot of money and a lot of <laughs> uh, reputation. So here he is, Crowley. Oh, what a guy! Right, don't do discounts, my friend. Take it or leave it. Okay, so this is the thing, right? You can bird train. If you have already purchased one of my amazing bird perches, all you have to do is place your bird on it. Uh, birds may be a bit mischievous at first, but don't despair. You can train them by giving you, giving them one of my cookies every time they behave. And if I were you, I wouldn't even bother trying another type of food. So you've got to give them special cookies. The the best trainer said the bird is fully accepts its owner, shows respect. So this is what you can do. You can buy a buy a parrot. Oh, there's so much money, though. But guys, look. There's the parrot egg. We can actually afford this. And we can actually get the bird perch as well. Shall we get the medieval one or the standard tavern bird perch? Which perch should we get, guys? I can't afford the Imperial one, which looks amazing. Should we go with Medieval? I kind of like the, just the classic bird perch, if I'm honest. I'm going to go with that. Uh, and then we're going to need some ca uh, crackers to train. Now, do we need a bird cage, Or can you get a, a perch? Are they, are they the same? Similar? Do you need one or the other? Two cookies a day. Don't give cookies when you don't need to. So you can just get the perch You don't need to actually get a cage Oh if you have several birds I see Okay so this is going to cost 9 gold But you know what I've never seen this I've never done this in this game And I'm quite interested to it I know we should be using this money to expand <laughs> But If you have too many cookies, a furry blue monster will show up. David, are you lying? So how many we should get? Like, 20? David's here with the bants. Oh my god. Right, okay, so hold on. How do we hatch the egg? Guys, how do we hatch it? Cookie monsters everywhere. Talk to him again. Ah. 
Hatching eggs. Uh, okay. All you have to do is carry the egg around with you until it hatches. That reminds me. If you find any strange eggs around, don't hesitate to bring them to me. Many species require certain special conditions. Uh, you are very lucky to have an expert like me. Okay. So we just walk around and it will hatch. I wonder how long that's going to take, but I'm excited we're going to get a little bird. It's like Pokemon, yeah. <laughs> oh, a parrot inside the tavern, guys. He's going to be talking to the customers. Hopefully not swearing at them. And uh, he's going to help with... I don't know if he helps with reputation or money, but I, I do think you get some bonuses for it. That is so cool. I love that. Right, but you know what, guys? I'm going to have to actually end the stream now. I'm, I'm so sad we couldn't do the VIP. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, in the next, I'm going to stream this again, I think, um, sometime next week. And we're going to continue with this. And hopefully, have a parrot by then. We've done so much, though. Look how big the room's looking. We've done so much in today's stream. It will tell them there's rats in the kitchen. It will swear at them. They'll swear at them in the beginning. <laughs> and then they'll tell them there's rats in the kitchen. No! Yeah, okay, let's save. That was a long stream. God, this game does take over your life. Thank you so much for everyone who's tuned into the stream. Uh, even from the beginning. If you've been here from the beginning, wow, that was commitment right there. And thank you so much for nearly 250 likes. You guys are the best. Uh, welcome to the new members. I appreciate you and everyone who's donated and made a super chat. Yes, what a stream that was. Thank you so much, guys. Take it easy. I'm going to have some food, and I'll see you all on the next one. Stay cozy as well. Stay cozy. Whew. That was long. That was addictive.